Yo guys, welcome back to a brand new PDCGO live stream, guys. We just reached 11k subs today, and I was kind of bored today, so I was like, let's go and stream. I haven't streamed in a while. This might actually be the very last stream in this current house that I am living in, so honestly, I thought it'd be a good time to stream and uh, just play some decks. I've got no plans today. I'm kind of bored, um, so I was like, yeah, let's whip out the old stream and... Uh, see how we do um and just kind of play some pdcgo there's a new streaming layout here on youtube but it's kind of sus not gonna lie um but uh we'll make it work i missed like the old classic streaming setup but anyways we're gonna be streaming testing some decks i want to thank you guys for 11k subs and um, maybe streaming can help fix that weird issue with um with the uh, thing with my uh, likes and views right now. But let's check the chat. Yo, there's a lot of people in the chat right now. Holy cow, there's a lot of people. There's a lot of people to catch up with. Yo, Mika, MT Grave, um, Joseph, Davey, Simone, uh, Ben, Jake, Claudio, Dark Knight, DJ Diamond, Leonardo, Brain Fox, Mika, Schnuggy. What are you guys, how are you guys doing? And Claudio, yo, how are you guys doing, guys? How are y'all doing? Thanks for stopping by on the stream. Yo, Mr. Brain Box, how you doing? Yeah, here we go. We're streaming. We're seeing how it goes. Uh, there's this new... I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this new YouTube layout. Before we get into PDCGO, I'm looking at this new YouTube layout here for the streaming. Because I always streamed in the classic settings. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that before. But uh, now we're streaming in this new setup. Because I, I tried to go back to the classic setting and it would not work. So, that's unfortunate. But, yo, I appreciate it, guys, for uh, everyone saying congratulations. Hating YouTube bugs. I know, I'm hating the YouTube bugs too. I don't know what, the algorithm must have changed or something. It's my, like, the views drop. But anyways, the Altaria Green video is doing really well. All the people that like that has pretty much shown that, yes, likes do contribute to the YouTube videos getting views. Um, Curse Light deck? Yeah, we might play some Curse Light. We have a lot of decks to play. He mismounts mine. Yo, it's Mika. It's Mika, right? What do you think of Toxtricity? I think Toxtricity is decent. Maybe we can build Toxtricity. Yo, thank you, Mike. I literally found this guy one month ago, and I already watched this guy from morning to midnight. Yo, I appreciate it, Brain. I appreciate it. You should try ADP my low tick. Nah, I don't think it'll... I don't think I'll be playing ADP. Well, I might play my ADP Altaria deck, but I don't think I'll be playing ADP. I might actually do some Players' Cup. I haven't uh, done the Players' Cup. I've done two Players' Cup tourneys, and I pretty much rage quit because it was nothing but an ADP fest. So I was like, all right, that is not worth my time. So we'll see. Uh, let's get some music in here, actually, real quick. Um, how do I add something here? Okay, I'll go. Okay, let's go. Just go back to PC Joe now. All right, uh, I'm gonna add some music real quick before we uh, start finding some games. All right, here we go. This might be really loud for like a quick second here while I go and find the music. All right, I'm gonna put on Sinnoh Rival Battle. All right, that's gonna be loud, guys. All right, there we go. I turned it down a little bit. Hopefully, it's not too loud. Shout out to Glitch City for the music. All right, now we can play PC Joe. Now we can play some PTCGO. So I have put Salamence in the thumbnail. I'm gonna try on my Salamence VMAX Swana deck first. Um, but yeah, we're definitely gonna be playing a lot of, we're gonna be doing a lot of stuff. I might try the Player's Cup. ADP is annoying indeed. Expanded, maybe. I already finished the versus rewards though, so I don't really have an incentive to play Expanded. I only really play Expanded when recording. Are we up against Grant Manley? Is that, is that Grant Manley? Bear Scooter was bug. I never tried that, but I saw Trainer Chip's video on it. Right, he's playing a fire deck. I mean, I think we still want to go first, right? We're playing Swana. ADP. Yeah, ADP sucks. When do packs come available in store with coins? Oh, they're always available, Brandon. They're always available. Ah, oh, this hand's this hand's sus. Yo, do you think you'll do viewer games? Probably not today. I just want to kind of just casually just chill and test some decks. Um, I do want to do a viewer stream at some point. Okay, we drew a ducklet. I think we just pass. This hand sus. I mean, that Ducklet top deck made up for it. Champion's Path is what I meant. No, Champion's Path not coming to the store, Brandon. It's only going to be accessible through coins. Or it's only going to be accessible for codes. Is this Grant Manly, though? Does anyone want to... Does anyone... Can anyone confirm if we're playing as Grant Manly right now? I'm saving... Yeah, I'm saving for Viv Vivid Voltage, too. I am not buying packs from the shop no more. Anyone like Shiny Legends? I mean, it's okay. Viewer streams is every legacy stream. Indeed. Yeah, maybe we could play legacy. You never know what we'll do today. It looks like we're playing as baby blounds. Um, hmm. I don't know if we can beat this. Even though we have swanas. 
Hmm. We'll see what we can do. I kind of don't want to knock me out because I want to play the scoop up net here. So I can try to draw as many cards as I can with Crobat. We probably just get bodied, right? If we're playing against... If we're actually playing against Grant Manley right now, right? Do we just get bodied? Just gonna break the game over and over and over again. <laughs> Chunky Pika. I'm, a, I'm Pikachu VMAX is probably gonna be the first video I do in Vivid Voltage. Okay. It's interesting that he decided to knock out my Mew and bench the Cram. Let's see what we draw. That's a dead card, boy. All right, we're gonna have to just kind of play our hand down here a little bit. Let's just check what we got price. We got our Salmon. Salmon's might be okay here. Um, everything seems to be intact. We just need to like draw some basics here off this Crobat. We could boss the Cram up, or we could even boss the Mewtwo and knock it out. I think though we just want to try to get like a Marnie or something here. No. Okay, that's fine. We'll get Ducklet. We'll get the big duck. The big duck thing. What is Feather Slice? I think I'll get rid of the boss. Don't think we need boss. The only deck I play right now is Eternatus. I might play Eternatus in my next OPOP League match. I'm not not certain yet. Decidueye Ops Dagoon Altaria. If we do play the if we do some players' cup games today, guys, I might just play that's why I might play. I might play uh I might play Altaria or Decidueye Goons. Because that's like the only deck that can beat ADP consistently, I find. And unless you get like a horrible setup and they get lucky with Mawile. But that's why I like I just haven't been playing the Players Cup because it's literally just like it's nothing but ADP. It's just it's it's not fun to play. You know, it's not fun to play against constant ADP. Dragapul Gengar deck. Nice. I do have a uh, I have another Gengar deck coming out soon, hopefully. There's a new Gengar promo which looks pretty rad. Alright, this is not terrible. Again, can anyone chat confirm that this is actually a professional player Grant Manley? Uh, do we want to put a big charm on? We go up to 140 HP. That doesn't make a difference. Well, we got to see what Stellar Wish gets us first. Got a quick ball. We'll take the calm. We need to find like a researcher Marnie or something here. All right, come on, Stellar Wish. All right, let's go. Let's go. Uh, Vivid Voltage should be out on the Friday in the shop. Vivid Voltage will be out on the Friday. Actually, oh, we should have gotten Salamence here. No, I think I still want to get Swana. Actually, honestly, I'll get Salamence. I should have, I definitely should have just put the big charm on the Salamence instead of the Ducklet. That was a misplay. Whatever. I don't think we're going to be able to attack him this turn. Yeah, we didn't get there. So what we're going to do is we're just going to use this opportunity to power up a Salamence V. Um, play this, I guess. Sure. Not too late. I already played it. <laughs> I probably should have held that. Grant Manley is a, uh, he's a, he's someone that's on uh, team DDG. He's like, a, he's a really good player. I think he was like, he had like the most like points in the world before the lockdown. Yo, Damon, how you doing? Do you plan streaming more? I, it's kind of hard to stream nowadays, but uh, it, in the area that I live right now, we might go back into lockdown soon, so we'll see. I won't be able to stream that much during October. This might be the last stream in this house because I'm moving at the end of October, and I'll probably be too busy to stream. Uh, Not really, Terry, honestly. I don't think I would change anything. Mm -mm. Not this Friday. Ooh, interesting that he decided to knock that out. So, hmm... We need to find a triple and a Salamence here, I think. That'd be pretty good. We just lose, though, if he goes some, if he knocks out Salamence VMAX. I don't know. It's probably not going to happen. We'll just... I don't know. I think we've lost this. This is a hard matchup. We got to get lucky here. to get, no, I don't think we're going to get there yet. We got the VMAX. So didn't get much else, though. I mean, I guess we can go like Mew. I, I kind of, I feel like just Mewtwo actually for the research. So the next turn we can attack with the VMAX. 
I might just go research here, actually. I don't know, because we're one triple away from knocking him out. We have a Marnie. I kind of want to get the Mew so he can't snipe my bench again. But what are the chances he has another Welder? He didn't. He hasn't done Mewtwo yet, so there's a chance he doesn't have anything here. So I think actually we just go... Um, I'm going to go Mewtwo for research. There's a chance he doesn't have Welder, right? So, like, he has a four-card hand. He has no scoop net, so he doesn't have anything. You ever plan on opening packs? Probably not. I don't really play IRL. Take advantage of Russia players. Yeah, we're already back in stage two. Yep, and that in, like, the Toronto area. Yeah, but I'm in the Durham region. Catching the OPOP. -OP. I mean, yeah, it's not bad. I'm doing decent in the OPOP -OP league. I am surprised. But, oh, he had the welt, bro. How? That's sus. So he just snipes the Salamence. There's nothing we can do. Altar is a good tech to play in any deck to counter ADP. Yeah, it definitely is. Only four Decidueye, four Rowlet, four Candy, 50 Energy. Yeah, we can maybe build Toxtricity if you want. Yo, curse you, how you doing? Oh, he has Goon too, bro? I did not expect him to play Zigzagoon. He does lose Oracorio. Now I wish I got Mew. I didn't expect him to have the friggin' Welder in his hand, though. He, like, there's, I was like, there's no way he has Welder. But he, he magically found it. What is the best theme deck right now? I don't know. Relentless Flame? This dude is, <laughs> this is nutty. I'm pretty sure we're playing against Grant Manley. If you guys don't know who this is, this is he's one of the best players in the world. Um... I mean, we kind of have to Marnie him, but we I really want to find the triple energy. Hmm. Let's see if we can rip a scoop up net here. No. I don't think we're going to win this. We drew kind of poorly, too. We could just Marnie and try to rip the thing off. The, yeah, you know, this is Marnie. Try to rip the triple here. Triple scoop up net? No. Yeah, I mean... I don't think we're going to win this, folks. I don't think this game was meant to be... Summon so Tri seems busted. It does when you draw well. I'm a huge fan of the Mewtwo Unbroken Bond Steam deck. You should try that. I don't know if I think that deck. I don't know if that deck's good though, bro. Giving the rogue decks to play say need. Yes, sir. Okay, just a beat catch. We don't have another Marnie though. Speaking of Relentless Flame, I used to Needle Queen. Needle Queen's good in that deck, so let's treasure it. Mill exists in the theme format. I'm doing good, Joey. How are you doing? Yo, Kyle, how you doing? Okay, all right. do we really need all these bird keepers, bro? I mean, we could actually bird keeper into the ducklet and go swana. Well, he just needs one prize to win. Oh, we got lucky he didn't have me there. So we need to find a Marnie here. So we need to go Marnie, and we need to hope we get a triple scoop up net here. That's probably not going to happen. We probably should have just went bird keeper. Let's see if it would have mattered. Yeah, we should have went bird keeper. Yeah, if you guys haven't dropped a like in the stream yet, make sure to do so. Yo, Elliot, what's going on? Is it good because it has the Mewtwo? Hmm. I don't know. You lost? Yeah. We drew kind of weird here. We really needed to move the Jirachi out of the active spot and go to Salamence. I mean, we could still live the turn, right? If we survive here, we can probably knock out this Cramorant. I, I think it's too late to win, though. I don't think we can make a comeback at this. We literally just need to knock one more thing out and he wins. Three stun fizz V, Corviknight line. Maybe we can play that today. Cramorant and VMAX is coming. Yeah, I saw it. It looks pretty cool. I like how they made it a Blissey 2.0. Yeah, I don't think we can win this, right? We have we also don't play any resets. If we had a reset stamp, maybe we can make a comeback. If we had a reset stamp, maybe we could have made a comeback here. I mean. I'm just trying to think. There's nothing I can do, right? It doesn't matter what I do here. I haven't seen many players playing the new champ decks. The Machamp deck? I haven't seen many people play that either. Let's see if he has game here. He probably does, right? I mean, he needs to do 350 damage, so we'll see. You should play it when it comes out. Yeah, I'll play Domai's VMAX. I think that's coming out in the February set, though. I don't know if... <laughs> can you guys confirm if Cram's coming out? 
in the, uh, yeah, can you guys confirm if Cram's coming out in Vivid Voltage? I don't think it is. That's why I say for, yeah, I'm saying Vivid Voltage is a, there's some decent stuff. Machamp stuff's good. Maybe we can play that today on stream. Yeah, it's not, I think it's in the February set. I don't think it's in Vivid Voltage. I can't wait for Shiny Star V. Yo, those cards look nice. All right, let's see if he can KO me here. He has to do 350 damage. I mean, if he doesn't knock me out, I mean, I think our only win condition would have to be we had to get a reset stamp. We had to get a reset stamp to win this game. I don't know, bro. Oh, no. I don't know. Okay, I got to stretch. Sorry, guys. I'm just stiff. Like, I didn't get much sleep last night. So my body's just, like, really sore. Yo, Jigglypuff, how you doing? It's coming. Oh, it's in a collection box. For Shedinja? That Shedinja looks interesting. Yeah, February. Shedinja ADP. That'll probably be a deck. Garbodor ADP might be a deck, too. You never know. So you play, you play ADP with it. You literally... <coughs> I'm surprised no one's played ADP Baby Blount at this point, bro. What's your pin on Pikaram and Standard? I think it's good. It won two tournaments back-to-back -back yesterday. Pika does seem pretty good. All right, let's see if he has enough energy to knock me out. He probably does, right? I'm pretty sure we were playing against Grant Manley here. So, I mean, yeah, yeah, that's 400 damage. I mean, we honestly could have won this. I feel like if we had a stamp or if we were able to attack a bit earlier, we might have had a shot of beating my opponent there. If that was Grant Manley, that means my elo is high, so called it, Kappa. Shedinja is this whole reason why I'm saving for Viva Voltage. But that's going to be a cheap card, though, anyways, Mika. It's not going to be that expensive. I want to make a Macho Revenge deck. I mean, we could play Machamp later. Yo, I want more cash. How you doing? Just play one Shin Engine stage ones. All right, let's see if we can uh, draw a little bit better here. We got if, we got seventy seven people in the stream, guys. Yo, welcome or seventy four people. Yeah, welcome guys to the stream. I'm got, I'm getting used to this new uh, this new stream layout that YouTube has here, the YouTube Studio stream layout. It's kind of it's sus. I, I prefer the old the classic layout is always better, but I mean we gotta work with what you got. Does Shedinja Boy work? Maybe. It could work, Savon. All I play is standard nowadays is Starly Control. That's a big brain deck. I don't think I'd ever play a control deck, really, guys. It's just, I, I'm just not good at playing those decks. Congrats on 11k. Yo, thank you, Mork. I appreciate it. Oh, shoot. Yo, Weezing actually kind of bodies me because we don't have any... Um, we don't have any... Uh, we can't use our ability on Swana. Yo, Captain Z-Man, congrats on 11K. You're the best PCO channel on YouTube, hands down. Keep up. Yo, thank you, man. I appreciate the $5 tip. Yo, thank you, bro. Thank you, guys. We had some love in the chat for my boy Captain Z-Man. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Thank you, man. Is Greensard good? Yeah, Greensard is good. It's performing pretty well right now. Like, fire decks are really good right now because of how good Zacian is. Doesn't get an energy in play. That's really good. Okay, so... Boom, boom, bam. I think we just go calm for... Uh, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe we could actually just go roll it here. We could not we can hit this. We can hit this for six. I kind of want to hit this for sixty. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna hit this for sixty. I'm gonna go for it. Okay, that's not a really good draw. Put Bird Keeper back on top. I guess we'll do. Is Corbin in the deck? I don't know. We'll hold the hand. I probably... I think I misplayed here. I probably should have done Quick Ball for Salamence first. Yeah, I definitely should have done Salamence there. That was a misplay. I should have went Salamence. Can I get a private trade from you? But what is the private trade? I'm not really looking for anything right now, Ghost. And I don't know if I really have much for trade that I'm looking to give away. Funny thing is the mill decks end up milling themselves. And that can happen. I don't keep up with the game anymore. Wait, hold on. Where's that from? Oh, the chat's moving so fast. Have you looked at Toxicity Mill? Not yet. I don't know if I will. In all honesty. Ooh, that Malon is good discard. So, why would he evolve the one that had damage on it? 280 HP. Hmm. All right, hopefully our Ducklet lives here. Okay, nice. I see we draw. Other than the Bird Keeper, I gotta stop saying that. So, we're gonna swing with Altaria or Swana. 
Swana here. Yeah, we're going to swing with the Swans. I'm playing my Swana Salamence VMAX deck. Which will be a video on the channel at some point in the future. Okay, nice. So, good, good cards, good cards. Uh, I want a quick ball for Crobat. I don't know if it's in the deck or not, though. I think we risk it, though. I really hope it's in the deck. Please don't be prized. Thank you for not being prized. Yeah, I saw the new Cram VMAX. It's going to be pretty interesting. Literally a Blissey 2.0, which is kind of sick. All right, nice. How much HP does he have left? One f oh, we can knock him out with another Swana next turn if we live the turn by some random miracle, which I don't think will happen. I think we just try to knock him out with Salmon's VMAX. Actually, I don't know if that's possible. We might be stuck here. I wish we, we probably should have stabbed another Swana, to be honest. Baby Dragapult deck? I mean, you just you got to play with basic energy, I think. Oh, he actually brings in the Salamence. I'm fine with this. That means we can uh, try to go with a Feather Slice. Please make an expanded vid on Cram VMAX. We'll definitely play it in both standard and expanded, 100%. I think you just got to pay Baby Dragapult with, like, maybe Crushing Hammer and Yell Grunt, stuff like that. I, that might be the best way to play it. I won't be in chat for now. That's all good, man. We'll be streaming for an hour or so, so, yeah. So, I don't have any Denes or Crobats, so I have none, and I'm forced to use Eldegoss Veer or Corio. No, I don't. I'm going to do my homework while listening to this. That's all good, bro. It's all gooch. Cram VMAX will be uh, most will be the most fun VMAX. Yeah, it will. It's going good, quarantine. It's going good, man. And yeah, thank you for uh thanks, man. Eleven K subs. It feels pretty awesome. So we need to get a bird keeper scoop up net here of our top deck. Capture energy. So we can we have the Eldegoss, I think, for Bird Keeper. Let's see if we can rip one here. Okay, yeah, never mind. We good. We can just go here. Okay, let's see what we get here. Oh, we didn't get the Salamence V. No! Okay, I'm going to get another Ducklet. I'm going to Feather Slice. So, Rowlet, Double Swan, and knocks out a turn to VMAX. Good to know. It's probably... No, oh, he has no other energy in play. We can still win this. We have a boss. So, we can, we can hunt down another turn to his next turn, which is pretty cool. The scope can save Weezing. I don't think it'll save Weezing. Um, if Weezing ever gets good, I mean, honestly, all you have to do is play my low ticks in your deck, and you're, you can beat it. Play it with Porygon Z. Will you make a video on Dalmai's VMAX? Yeah, I'll be doing a video on all the VMAXs, most likely, when they come out. Cram, Cram V doesn't rotate, though, Mika. And I'm pretty sure they're 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 making another there's another Cramer V coming out either. I think it's a promo or a reprint thing. My low tick heck W. <laughs> nah, bro. Yo wreck. Nah, it's not it's not like that, bro. My low tick's too good. Honestly, in DDV is a really low key underrated card, especially against goons. Okay, the Marnie, that's a little annoying because we have the double boss to knock to bring this thing in. So all we have to do is just hit this and then knock it out with Salamence. If we get a scoop up net, that's what I'm looking for. No, we got a bird keeper though, so we can attack again as long as he doesn't go wheezing. Go, go, go. Yo, what's up? Mimikyu for GXs? Eh. You ever made a Scizor VMAX? Yeah, I never. I don't. I, I don't know. I just kind of felt like a bland deck. Oh, uh, Rip, he has a net. I guess he can knock out this annoying thing. God, please don't have Galarian wheezing. He is down quite a few uh, supporters, which is nice. The two boss is good, actually. Oh, okay. He doesn't have it. You'll love to see it. Okay, I want to get a scoop up net here. Didn't get it. How much will Jirachi's Amazing Rares? I don't know. I forget what that card does. I can't remember what the Amazing Rares do. <laughs> the Amazing Rares, well, they'll be overpriced at first, right? They're probably harder to pull, so. I mean, we'll see. I mean, do I want to go with the... No, I think we just want to go with the Fresh Swana. I don't think it matters. Can't find scoop up net. I really want to get a scoop up net here so I can get um a Salamence V Max down. It's a little annoying we haven't found it yet. We can do it next turn, I guess. Sorry, Ducklet. You must be sacrificed for the greater good. Like our game plan has to be hit this and then to go Salamence V Max. Congrats on eleven K, you'll thank you, Dream. 
Yo, LDF. Yo, Daniel. How you doing? Can you show a refined version of Greensard? Why? I don't have that deck built. But if you go on YouTube, you can find recent builds of it. Oh, it has Musharna. It has to be active. It doesn't sleep. Hmm. Thank you, Dream. All right, did I already read that? I'm sorry, guys. The so chat's moving kind of fast. I'm just going to use this new layout. <laughs> Drachi looks at top two. Okay, yeah. I feel like... How many scoop up this down? The only way you can win this is if you match the Rowling and then bosses the Crobat. So we need to get a Bird Keeper and a Scoop Up Net. Or we, well, we could just comp for Eldegoss. I'm just going to... No, we're just going to get the Salamence. I really just want to get the Salamence built up. Okay, we got the Scoop Up Net. Oh, but we can't do Mewtwo. I mean, all we have to do is actually boss up the Crobat we win. Hmm... I don't even know what I want to do. So I scoop the Mewtwo. I don't think that does anything. I think we want to scoop up net the... I mean, we kind of have to. I... This is tough. Maybe I should have taken the Marnie, actually. I don't know. This doesn't really seem winnable anymore, in all honesty. We'll have to just try to tank with a Salamence VMAX and hope for the best, I guess. Really wish we found Scoopnet a bit earlier, though. Most schools block YouTube. Yeah, I know. Wish I had a second account because this fit is blocked in my school. Oh, man. About to play an IRL tournament in a bit. Yo, good luck, Daniel. <laughs> Imagine, though, watch. You can see in the future. Okay, well, I'm trying to think what I want to do. Do I want to Marnie next turn? I mean, we kind of have to. We could Guru and rip a Bird Keeper off of that. It's probably not going to happen, though. I think we just got to go Mewtwo for Marnie. I think we're going to lose this, though. I mean, we're literally... He knocks us out. You just get Boss Crow Bandy wins. If only we were able to find our uh, Scoop Up Net a bit earlier. That's what we really needed. We need to fill up our bench spot a bit more. Do you have any Shamans? Uh, I don't think I have any shame any X's for trade, no. Trying to get Hitmonchan? Yo, thank you, Ray. Do you think Alolan Marowak is usable? It, it's decent. I do have a deck built on that, and there may be a video on that in the future. It could be okay. You have to get lucky, though. Oh, he's going to boss me now? He's, does he knock out? If he knocks out Simons, we just lose. Oh, he doesn't knock it out. Okay, good. Now we need to find the VMAX, though, and the triple. It's not looking likely. Dang it, bro. We got the triple. We didn't get the VMAX. I thought that was a VMAX. I got hyped for a sec. Oh, my goodness. All right. Swan of Salamence. I think it plays well when it draws well. But other than that, it doesn't draw well. So, it doesn't work. New private offer. Yeah, I'll check this out. Usually fast forward videos. Hmm. Hitmon combo isn't viable anymore because Tapu Lele rotated. I mean, it's decent still. Yo, sorry, man. I'm not looking for any archaeology. It's not even... You can't even use this card other than Legacy, and I don't need it, man. I'm sorry. Sorry, bro. I can't accept the offer. Seems like... Yeah. Give, your opponent controlled the damage. All right. Let's switch the deck up here. Um, I kind of want to play this double Magneton deck I built. Let's try this. I'm playing ADPZ because you can't play anything else. Yeah, I know. ADP sucks. Maybe... We might do a couple players' cup matches. We'll see. I'm doing good, good. Thank you, man. How you doing, bro? How you doing, Noodle? With Curse. Yeah, Curse is pretty cool. Might maybe we'll build a, a thing. Is that an Astro World hoodie? It indeed is an Astro World hoodie. It is indeed. Here, I'll show you. It is yes, it is an Astro World hoodie. I got it I got a pretty good deal on it on Grailed. Offering a banned card, yeah. Well you can use it in Legacy, and Archaeops and Legacy is not that bad, in all honesty. But I already have enough uh Archaeops. I don't need any more man, so I just couldn't accept that. Well hands trash, that's great. So they're too expensive. Well, if you, have, if you have a decent amount of champions path packs, you can get a couple Crobats for like under 10 packs. That's a pretty good trade. Great. Nice. That's a pretty good trade. What is other than the state of mind? What do you mean, Robin? Uh, 
I put maybe we should put the cape on in case we get KO'd. I don't think we will. This guy had a bad start too. Hopefully he Marnie's me. That's why I want to see here's a nice big fat Marnie for my opponent. Oh, he's playing Whale Lord or he's playing Dreadnaw. You ever had interest in Airsoft? Not really. Yes, he's Marnie me. Alright, good. I, I don't I tried Airsoft. It's not really for me. Like I like I like the whole like idea of like kind of like it's like a mini like war simulation, whatever you want to call it, but well, I played with my friends one day, and just I wasn't feeling it. I just didn't really like it that much. But Airsoft is cool. I, all my friends do like it. Like, they do play it a lot. But personally, when I tried it, I was like, I don't I'm not, I'm not vibing with this. What are you playing? I'm playing Magneton Double. So far, not looking great. Hmm, probably should have put the Magnemite back. I mean, I guess we'll go Guru and try to high roll here. I don't know. We're probably going to lose this. Our draws are just so shoot. If we can get a giant heart, though, that would make up for it. No. Make a Shin... Shin... Shinotic deck? How many packs, packs from Crobat? Crobat's like a thing around like 17 packs, 18 packs for the regular art. And it's worth like 8 or 9 Champions Path packs. What are your thoughts on Ban ADP? I agree. I think it does need a ban. I uh, do not like ADP. I think it ruins the game because it's like it's 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 too good. It it just gave, if ADP got banned, the pool like the variety of decks would increase greatly. All right, there's a hearth. Do we have the welder to guru? That feels really bad. I think honestly, we just let him knock out the magnemite, and then quick ball next turn for thing, and then try to magneton. It's like 1.5 now. Well, I was no yesterday. I was looking on the uh, I was looking on trades and Crobat was still going for like eight or nine packs. No, the Marnie. I should put the Hearth in play, bro. Why is this guy Marnie me? Send your friend request. But Carner, that's the thing though. What is the uh, what is the friend request for? Like, I, I'm not. I don't add people anymore because I need my spots open for all the tournaments that I enter. So I actually can't accept any friend requests right now, unless you're like trading me something. I don't. Except friend requests anymore, dude. I'm sorry. Because I need my list open for, like, all the tourneys I'm in. Like, for the OPOP League, any Hexers I enter, or the PDCGO League tourneys that I do. You should have made... You should have Mad Party Tournament. I might, I tried playing... That was the deck I played when I entered the Players' Cup. I was playing Mad Party, and I kept playing against ADP, so I just rage quit. Yeah, the Machamp Extra deck's cool, but it can't beat ADP. But, yeah, if, like, ADP was banned, the pool of decks increases... I beat ADP with Butterfree. Interesting. Shout out to the PCG. Yeah, the PCO League is sick. They like the Rabbit Dragon does like really unique tournaments. Like it is worth it to enter those. I think ADP is cursing stage two decks. Yeah. Well, stage twos, they're just not really getting much love anyways. Like they're making some pretty bad stage twos. Regardless. Alright, let's see if we can get anything good here. No, nope. okay. Well. Drawing poorly feels really good. What do I even have in this deck? Should I just... Might have to edit this deck a bit more. He prizes water. Apparently. I like the idea of this double Magneton deck, but it drew, like, absolute trash. I think we need to play, like, Crobat. I have the hand... Okay, we can cut a Wheezing, I think. And probably a Familiar Bell. It feels like a bad card, too. We'll just play... I'm gonna play Crobat and Dedenne. Because dead draws are dead draws. Could cut a reset stamp too. I like the idea of playing the handlock wheezing though. ADP makes all singer prizes worse. It does. That's why I don't like ADP. I think it does need a ban. If like if ADP got banned, like the amount of tournaments that would have like really cool, like a really big pool of decks would be really cool. You know what I mean? Like the amount of people that would play more unique archetypes that don't work against ADP once ADP is banned would just it would make the format funner and more healthier. And not to mention, all the f all the decks that counter Eternatus and Pika that are fighting would also increase in popularity because there would be no ADP to kind of, you know, stop them. That is true. I mean, Boss's Order is a... I think Boss, Marnie, and ADP are like three pretty problematic cards in the format right now. Boss is OP because of Dedenne and Crobat. So you don't really get punished for having to play your supportive return as a Gust card. Marnie's annoying because it doesn't shuffle your deck. Um, and it's pretty much Marshadow 2.0. But yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, ADP, I don't run into it that much on the ladder. Yo, Big Pimpin, what's going on? What is going on, dude? We could probably switch up the song now, actually. Oh, I didn't have it on. Oh, the song. Oh, I didn't even realize the song shut off. I didn't put it on loop. I'm a dummy. All right, let's, let's change the song. We're going to put on Canto Wild Battle. I didn't realize the song changed. Rip. Okay, we're playing Senna Scorch. Yo, Kieran, how you doing? Just hanging out. Congrats, yo. Thank you, man. Ooh, this hand's dead. All right. Uh, can we rip a... Dead draws or dead draws? That's just research. We, I guess we could have went for a knockout here. That seems stupid, though. Thank you, Corey. I don't know if this is the correct play or not. We probably just lose this. Our hand is butt cheeks. Have you played Tricks Gym? Not yet. Well, not in the OPO, but I played him, like, I think twice before. I played him... I think I played him on stream once. I was playing an Inteleon um, Vileplume uh, GX deck. I think I beat him. He was playing Blastoise. But I have yet to play against him in the OPOP League. I'll find out tomorrow who my next opponent's going to be. Would you use it if there was no ADP? Would you use what, Landon? Sorry, did I miss your... Hmm. Get Hop as your draw. <laughs> Inteleon Amistar all day. That deck's pretty sick. I right, see if he, uh, what he does here. Yeah, this thing's pretty bulky. I don't know. I feel like this deck has to draw well to work, but I, I still think this is a cool archetype. It just needs to draw well and not have awful hands. Maybe we should play four double. I play three, but I should play four. So we want to be starting with double all the time, but I, I don't mind losing our Guru because we want to lose prizes in this matchup to fuel that double, but... I was gonna say, if we don't get another basic, we just lose. But we can do the giant, the welder here. Magnemite. There we go. Try to get another double. Bro, where's my dubs at, bro? Where's the doubles at? I don't think we need Jesse and James anymore. That can go. Okay, double. Bro. Where's my doubles at? Seriously. How are we going to win this? We can't get double. We didn't even get a giant cape either, which is pretty feels bad. We can knock him out next turn, potentially, if we live the turn. I don't know. I, this deck seems good if it sets up, but I feel like my list might just not. Maybe we should just cut the Jesse and James altogether and just kind of rely on raw power. We're also drawing, like, turd right now, which is not helping. Let's congratulate... I saw your green video. Hope the YouTube algorithm gets fixed. Thank you, Talon Knight. And yeah, I hope so too, man. Like, YouTube... I don't know. It's like, one day I'm pulling good views, and the next day my views drop by, like, 2k views, and my likes start disappearing and not working. My fairy used to be Dark Integral. I know some people say that I've kind of filled in the Dark Integral void. I mean, I've always done rogue decks, but the fact that, like, there's not that many rogue content creators out there anymore, you know. I didn't realize it was one-off. Yo, thank you, Daniel and Kieran. I see a Pokey Soft next time. Bye. You're playing Legacy? Giant Cape? Oh, yeah, Cape of Toughness. Yeah, you're right. Big dummy moment. All right, let's see what we draw here. Bro. <laughs> These draws are so bad, dude. I don't get it. I don't even know what I'm doing. hate ADP even though I play it <laughs> there's like there's cool ADP ideas like I feel like playing ADP with like a weird like combo is pretty cool um all right well we I guess we can play like one Jesse and James wouldn't hurt us I don't think the wheezing is necessary I think we should play a fourth double I don't even think I have a fourth double that's the only problem like I feel like this list is fine yeah we need to get a fourth double before we finish this but I feel like this list is okay we could play like maybe another Volk I guess too Go like four. Yeah, this seems a bit better. Let's go play a Marnie in here, but we already have the reset stamp. I know. I wasn't thinking local maple. I just gave up there at the end. But uh, yeah, expanded vanilla with vile plume. That'd be. Or, bleh, can't talk. ADP was not good until metal saucer. 
Yo, Xerneas, are you hitting me up with that double trade? Drop it faster than... Yo, you're, you're right, man. My draws. Yo, thank you, Xerneas. I appreciate it. Thank you, bro. Thank you, Wrecked. Greetings from Brazil. Yo, Walter. What up? You're just doing standard. Yeah, probably standard. I might play Legacy. We'll see. We'll see. I haven't really been playing Legacy that much. Other than for a Patreon video I did. Um, but we'll see. Yo, Brain. What's up, man? Play ADP with the Turntist. <laughs> Imagine. That would actually work. If they knock out the ADP before you... Uh, then you fill up your bench with nothing but darks. Not yet, Evan. I actually need one more shiny Charizard V before I finish that deck. But I do have another Charizard VMAX video I want to do a video on very soon. Um, but I need to finish that first. I need to get that shiny Charizard. Can I add you on a friend? Unfortunately, Brain, I need my friends list to be open. I'm not looking to add anyone because I need my list open for tournament matches. So, I, unfortunately, I I'm not really... I'm not a 70 friend request right now. I mean, we'll see, too, sure. I might do some Legacy. I mean, it is Legacy at the end of the day. It's still, like, a really fun format. Why are draws so poor? I don't know. Spanded ADP Vile Plume. Or Vanellux, sorry. What Vanellux, though? Local, what Vanellux are you talking about? Maybe with Corviknight Scoop Up Net? Eh, no, but Corviknight... That, was, that just seems too clunky. That Heart Top deck was good. All right, let's get a double here. Yeah, sorry, Brain. I just, I need my list open, right? Because I'm, I'm doing a lot of tournaments. I got the OPOP League. I'm in the PC, the PTCG League tourney. I'm in a lot of tourneys right now. I might actually do a tourney match on stream uh, for the PC Joe League. I message a guy saying we might play at three. So, we'll see. I tried it. I tried competing in the Players' Cup too, but unfortunately, it's not very fun. It's just nothing but ADP, and it's a headache to play in. But I might do some... We might we might play in the Players' Cup once today. ADP double. That actually sounds kind of interesting. <laughs> that actually sounds like good work. If they knock out the ADP, then double is already, like, ready to go. That actually doesn't sound like a bad idea. Thoughts on old Vs getting Vmaxes now? They'll survive rotation? I think it's interesting. I think Cramer and V is nice to keep around, but, like, the fact that Adene rotates, it'll, like, be, like, it won't be as good. Oh, but I, I feel like I don't know if paralysis deck works really that well in expanded though. We can try that maybe at some point In front of Fandango Embor, well, you got the one in the black and white base and there's one in legendary treasures And then there's a shiny one. The shiny one is probably worth around six packs. I think but the uh, uh, but, 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 What am I saying here? Uh, but yeah, the normal the Embor is worth like not even a pack like you can probably get it for pretty cheap what do you think about the best deck is? Unfortunately, ADP. Is Crobat burning expensive? Not really. Crobat, well, it's around 20 packs. Depends on what, what Crobat. Ooh, speaking of Crobats, what are these draws? We can knock him out here, but this thing is like fully loaded. So that seems kind of, well, he is actually down a lot of supporters. I wasn't really paying attention though. I don't want double to get knocked out though, but I think I'll take a knockout. We kind of need the prize. Our hand is dead, so. We need whatever we can get. It will be clunky, but it might be fun. Okay, dead prizes, bro. You hate to see it. Your elo is too low to snipe. I'm, I don't know, man, bro. I, I I was playing against Grant Manley in the first game on stream, so I don't know, Savon. Yo, thank you, Ty Lord. Floatstone. Floatstone would be a nice card to have back, but Air Balloon kind of works too. Air Balloon's a pretty good card. Longview Scope, Cram. I, oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. You could play that. Crobat for eight. But Crobat... Crobat GX goes for... Okay, this guy's got a busted. If we don't drop something, I think I just scoop because... Uh, I am tired of drawing a poorly today, folks. We have a lot of ways we can... We can draw Magneton. We can draw Dedenne. I mean... Bro, if we don't draw something here... Like, I still think this deck in, in theory works well. But, like, you gotta draw well with it. That's the only... Oh, my God. Bro... <laughs> The dead draws are real, dude. Oh my goodness. Okay, call for ADP. Guzmahala. That's true. Where's our Dakuno stall? Exit drill mill? No, I don't play those decks, Landon. I'm not a stall kind of player. They're boring to play, and they're just... I don't know. I'm not good at playing them. Choice Band or Longview Scope? 
Choice Band's still the better card. What I think they should reprint Silver Bangle, but make it so that it only works on, of course, non-Vs and GXs, and you can hit Vs and GXs for three more damage. If you bring any card back into standard, what would you choose? Enhanced Hammer or Silver Mirror? Or not Silver Mirror, sorry. Special Charge. Enhanced Hammer might be good because... Um... Because a lot of the special energy right now is, like, really popular. Not to mention, I think one of the most popular cards that's coming out is, um... The new special meta energy, which makes uh, Zacian and Zam a little bit more overpowered. You know, they're, you know, Zacian and Zam, they're, you know, metal's a little OP right now. I don't think they need that many cards to support them, but yeah. I would personally like to see Enhanced Hammer come back. Yo, Ghost with the $2 tip. See what I give? What, did you send me a trade request, though, Ghost? Okay, if I get to turn this, this is fine. What am I doing here? So we're gonna go Magneton next turn. Do Magneton like Jesse James and then Welder. I know you do not install. Yeah, yeah, it's all good, Lane. <laughs> Pokemon Ranger. Yeah, that'd be a good reprint. It would make ADP a little bit less like ridiculous. Yeah, it does return special energy to the deck. Yeah, I just want it for twin energy decks. Galarian Darmantan V Max. Nah, they, they keep printing all these really cool VMAXs, but they make them weak to metal, which is like the best type in the game right now. 11k for the pop Prince of Pokemon. Yo, thank you, man. ADVGYM. Thank you, bro. I appreciate it, dog. I appreciate it, bro. All right, how are we doing this? So we want to go Magneton. For Welder and... Ba -ba -boo -boo -boo. What do I need? I think we just swing here. We could take a second Welder. I could also just research his hand away, which also doesn't seem bad. Yeah, let's just do this. I think that's all I want to take. So we're going to go Surge, Welder, Research. I pulled a Cinderace VMAX of a dollar. Yo, that's actually hype. Cinderace VMAX isn't that bad of a card. It's not like amazing, but it is a decent attacker. Yo, Gary, how you doing, man? I don't think it would suck, but it would definitely make ADP like... It wouldn't, it wouldn't make it as good. Maybe we... I don't know. Well, I guess, like, if worse comes, we're going to Jesse and James them. That could slow them down. We could just Jesse and James here and then research next turn. But I think we need to get into a Welder. So I'm going to get another Magnemite here. Oh, I should put Eldegoss. I didn't put Eldegoss. That's another card we probably could play. Galdagos would be good in here. Okay. 150 damage. We can knock him out if he knocks me out. Fire's most OP type because Welder. Yeah. Well, I mean, Welder's OP, but I think... I At first... Yeah, I remember everyone hated Welder when it came out, but now people like Welder because it's one of the only decks that can counter Metal, and Metal is ridiculously overpowered right now. Oh, rip. We didn't get a Welder of our own. We have to Deddy change, probably. Well, maybe we live the turn. This guy has a literal, like... He has to get a bunch of Pokemon to even knock me out. We need to find a Cape of Toughness. Of course, he plays Hammers, bro. See, they should just scrap Crushing Hammer altogether and just reprint Enhanced Hammer. I'd rather Enhanced Hammer than... Like, if Crushing Hammer just needs to go. The special Energy? Well, the Metal one for sure. It's definitely the Metal. The Horror, horror Energy is good, too. Horror Energy is also good. Focus Band? I, th I think Fighting should get a bit more support just to help balance out the Dark Meta for sure. Send you a private trade. You have to be online for private trade. Okay. Well, what Hitmonchan are you looking for, Ghost? I think the best special energy is Twin. Twin is good, but I mean, if we're talking like in terms of like competitive, I think the metal energy is going to make the most impact. But Twin is also good. Triple is also really good. Twip, triple energy is one of the best design cards, in my opinion. Triple energy is up there with like Ditto Prism as like one of the best design cards of all time. I'm actually going to be sad when that rotates. Calm for Magneton Welder. Oh, yeah, yeah, we can do that, too. You're right, you're right. Looks like he's stuck anyways. Um, that's good. So we can knock this out here, which seems pretty good to me. So we can go Calm for Magneton. Do we have Boss in the deck? Yeah, we do. Okay, so we can, we can go get Boss here. 
boss this up. We did, we did 150. We're doing... Oh, we don't have a knockout. Shoot. Okay, no, we're not doing that. Never mind. Okay, we don't have a knockout. Never mind. I kind of just think I hold the hand, though, to be honest. I think we just knock this out. Yeah, I think we just hold the hand. Uh, maybe we could, I guess we could have researched. I really want to get a cape of toughness down. Yeah, I don't know. I probably should have just went for cape there, to be honest. But I think we can tank with another double. I probably don't even do Magneton unless we really have to. Sunfist VMAX. Yo, that should, they should print that. Wait, it's a special grass energy. Oh, they haven't... Have they not done on grass yet? I feel like they have. How did Bear Skewed from Real Clutch get banned? It was bugged. Imagine a 500 HP monster do 200 damage when you attack it. Imagine. Yo, Tom. Hi, LDF. How you doing? I love your channel and your awesome decks. You're the best, dude. Thank you, Tom. Thank you for the uh, donation, bro. I do appreciate it a lot, man. Thank you, man. Thank you, dude. Let's get some love in the chat for my boy, Tom. But yeah, thanks, man. Well, we do have a new supporter, Kieran, that does accelerate fight energy in uh, the next set. 260? Yeah, I did 260. I'm waiting for Waylord VMAX. They'll probably do that, let's be honest here. They've done VMAXs for cards that don't have Gigantamaxes. Example, Salamence. Like, no cap. When I was making this thumbnail, I was trying to... I googled Salamence Gigantamax, and there was none. Because, like, oh, yeah, there is no... It's They just they just made it a VMAX because they ran out of Gigantamaxes to make things on. Which I find hilarious. Alright, let's see if he has a KO here. I think he does. Yeah, he definitely has a knockout. We can knock him out, though. We have to deal with another turn to this. But I guess we knock this out. We just got a boss Crobat to win. So we should probably just hold the Magneton for boss. Delmai's VMAX is grass. Del I think Delmai's VMAX is literally 10 short on a Zacian. It sends us all but worse. I mean, fighting does need the support, though. You could have knocked out the Eternus VMAX. No, I couldn't have, Saul. I was only doing 180 if I went Magneton. I was only doing one, And he had 190 HP left. I would have been 10 off. If I had a powerful energy on my double, I would have been able to take the KO. Oh, what? He's retreating? Wait, what? Okay. Um. Alright. Well, now we can take the knockout, right? Yeah, we can take a knockout. Waiting for SP on Prime reprint. I think one... They should definitely reprint a de-evolution type of card and make it actually like, kind of decent. That could be a decent way to balance VMAXs. So, we boss. Welder. Looking for cape here. Now, put... We'll put both on. Just because he has Crushing Hammer. There we go. We got a cape of toughness. I guess... Uh, it doesn't matter where I put that, to be honest. This is a pretty good hand, though. Yo, told you this double deck actually works when it sets up. Another way to turn one Tina Chomp is Zen's Resolve. Maybe we can try that out. There's a lot of different Tina Chomp decks right now. Tina Chomp is a pretty good card still. You think they'll make another card in Mew 3 when it rotates? Ah, maybe. It's a creative card, so they might reprint it. Zacian VMAX would be broken. Yeah, probably. Alright, what do we get here? We need to find some reset stamps actually for next turn. Ooh, there's boss. So yeah, we just win next turn, actually. So yeah, we can go Magneton for boss. Or we can just boss. He, we'll see. I think we've got this, though. The dogs can't dynamo. It devolves one of your opponent's Pokemon. Oh, there is? Binette? Oh. Yeah, Binette might be good with Scoop Up Net. I kind of want a Garbodor VMAX. They'll probably do that. Garbodor VMAX is one of the... It's one of the bosses, too, in... Uh, in Sword and Shield, right? It's one, it's one of the final Pokemon you play against. So they probably will do a Garbodor VMAX. I bet Garbor VMAX will have an ability like Galarian Weezing where it's in the active, your opponent's abilities, and have like a good attack. The Hitmon Chain from Sword and Shield? Okay. Alright, well. Bro, I'm a dummy. Do we knock out. No, oh, yeah, we, we. Never mind. What am I doing? What am I doing? We still win. Never mind. I was like, oh, I'm a dummy. I screwed up. But we did not because we can actually just go Magneton to do the extra damage. Sure, we eat Garbotoxin. Yeah, Garbotoxin would help the game, especially because of Zacian. What if Garbotoxin was brought back? I think it'd be healthy for the game. All right, let's see. I think that's the same thing as what Xerneas sent me. All right, which one? 
Which one are you, ghost? Because I can't accept these requests. Unless it's you. Bro, I, I'd have to add you, bro, and then unadd you. Because, like, I, I need my friends to open for the uh, tournaments. The you reprint special charge. Yeah, I've been saying that, man. Special charge would be a great card to have back in the format. 100%. I, I don't know. I feel like we have enough good searching cards. We have Calm, Quick Ball. Uh, we have Great Ball. There's actually a decent amount of ball searching cards right now. I don't think we're actually out of ball cards. It was better than the old format. We had to use Nest Ball, Ultra Ball. Willard VMAX. Yeah, I definitely have a lot of HP. You know they announced Delmai's VMAX, Cramorant? Yeah, I saw that. I just think Darbertox would be good if you reprint Flowstone. But you could put an Air Balloon on it. We would have a 3 retreat though. Ever thought about using old PC? Yo, as a meme, sure. Okay, I guess while we wait for Ghost here, I'm just gonna do another game here. We're gonna play some Dreadnought VMAX Rose. I do have a Rose video coming out tomorrow. I'm not gonna say what deck it is, but there's a there's another there's a Rose video coming out tomorrow. I'm not gonna say what uh, VMAX it is with, though. Okay, let's see how we do. Stay beasting on PCGO. Well, thank you, man. Best popular VMAX is Wobbuffet, Whaler, Sunfisk. Haven't done it yet. Catch next stream. All right, all good, Ghost. Thanks for stopping by, man. Can I send you a trade too? Well, what are you trading me for? But I'm, I'm not like, I'm not looking for anything right now other than like a few things. But like, I doubt you'd have them. They're expensive. Already 11k. I know. That Honestly, I was surprised. Oh, what is his hand? Actually, it's not. Eh, it's, if we can draw a Dreadnought V or a Dead End, this hand is not bad. Glaring Six Goon, Glaring Slow Bro together is Donk. Yeah, maybe. Dude. Bruh. I mean, we have to Dead A change. I mean, it's not the end of the world to Dead A change here because. I don't know. We can we can conserve this by doing float up, which is kind of cute. Okay, let's do this. Let's get type null. Let's calm for Kuno. Got all the Dridnaws. Pass. I didn't put Glimwood Tangle in this deck, by the way, guys. I do not play Glimwood in here. We could swap the variants up for Glimwood, though, I guess. But I didn't put it. I forgot to put it in here, but I don't know. Alchemy? Eh. I don't know if I'll play Alchemy. I do have an Alchemy Dragapult deck, actually. Maybe I can play that. Do you think Baby Grimmsnarl is any good? I don't think it's good at all, but I think it's a fun little rogue to play. And I do have a Grimmsnarl uh, deck built that I want to do a video on at some point in the future. I mean, yeah, Rose is definitely a decent investment. I think it's like, it's still kind of decent. It's, maybe it's even underrated right now. I'd go as far as to say it might be a little underrated right now. How do you get all this fancy stuff? Uh, just over time, just having a bunch of packs and uh, stuff like that. Accumulation of wealth, as people would call it. Articuno Stall is returned. Indeed. I didn't get energy on it, turned to switch is good. I guess one thing this guy could do is Galarian Weezing, and then I can't do... Then we don't have Kuno's ability, but that doesn't really matter too much. Okay. This is good. So we can go Dreadnought, Attach, Float Up. Ah, oh, is Sweet to, is sweet to Grass? Not Weak to Grass, bro. What do you mean? I would honestly probably could stay in the active spot, in all honesty. We're not getting knocked out next turn. Probably could stay in the active. It is what it is. What are the top five or three supporters? Uh, Marnie Research Boss. I think Marnie Boss Research in that order. Station Tax for Energy? Yeah. I love how LDF stays in the grind and PCG is always hustle motivated, shows dedication. Indeed. Well, yeah, it's my full time job being able to do daily uploads, you know. 
I do enjoy PDCGO a lot, but the standard format right now, it is testing my patience, not gonna lie. There are days where I feel like I should just take a day off, because like, bro, I just can't. This format is so bad, but, you know, you just fight through it all. But I am, I still enjoy this game a lot. I may complain a lot in my videos, but I do enjoy this game. You know, there are some pretty annoying stuff right now on the game, but I still enjoy it. I, I may not be a big fan of the format right now, but I still enjoy this game. VMAX with Gengar? I have another uh, Gengar partner coming out soon, great. There's another Gengar partner I have in mind. I want to do, the reason I actually wanted to do another Gengar video was because they printed a new Gengar promo card. It goes into the Weezy, we can two-shot it. Congrats on the 11k, best piece of content. Yo, thank you, Christian. Marnie research boss welder surge. I don't know about surge, Mika. I would even argue um, a better supporter would be. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to think. I, I feel like there's a better supporter than surge on that list. Mar it would definitely go Marnie boss research welder for sure. Maybe even welder would be above research. I don't know. Um, what else? What's there's a fifth supporter? Reuniclus Gengar? No, nah, it's in standard. He's doing 80 damage, bro. What the heck? I didn't even realize. Yeah, Erica. I was thinking Erica too, but I don't think Erica is actually like that good. Okay. Please don't whiff a water energy here. No! We whiffed a water energy. I mean, we can't even use Solvali, which is the worst part about this. I think we just retreat the Articuno and go into the other Articuno. No, I don't think Erica's the best. Maulana. Oh, Maulana. Maulana is what I was thinking of. Yeah, Maulana is definitely in the top five best supporters. It is. Maulana is a game changer, bro. Whenever that card gets played, bro, it swings the game in your favor. I'll check it out after local. I don't know if I'll play expanded today, though. We'll see. Maybe after this, we can try a Player's Cup tournament. Gardevoir, VMAX, Gengar. Yo, don't leak the spice, bro. Don't leak the spice. 13, 6 energy on average in my decks. Dang, that's a lot. Bird keep no, I don't think Bird Keeper's top, in the top, top percentage. Guzmahala. Yeah, Guzmahala is, it'd be, Guzmahala would probably be like bubble under like maybe 6th or 7th place. Guzmahala is not bad though. Alright, we're definitely just going to move the energy to the other... Articuno. Oh, I guess he could boss severe poison KO it. We don't even have a rose to go with the Dreadnought. I guess we'll skip as a boss. What's the best expanded deck? Uh, the best expanded deck is uh, Trevnor Milotic, I guess, in theory. We just haven't had any expanded tournaments to really decide that. Well, there was, there was one recently that did show that there was the possibility of Dragapult Gengar or Dragapult Garbodor being good. I think Expanded is good, and it's Expanded is an amazing format when there's no toxic decks like Eggrow, Vileplume, Alternate Krozma, Trevnor Handlock, Robo Sub Doll. Like when they're when when Expanded isn't like toxic decks, I think the format's actually amazing. Two ten healing it with that combo. I play Gavar Vmax Gengar Life Shaker plus Melotic. Yeah, oh, I forgot about the Melotic combo in there. I need to edit the deck. We'll see. I guess he might just, he could just go wheezing again. I don't even know if we can win this, to be honest. We can't even do Crobat, which is kind of bad. We drew a boss. We can boss Silvali. I think we just knock him out here. Just save the hand. We'll probably just, well, we're not going to take a prize. Oh my god. Dude, we're getting bodied by this wheezing. Kind of is, yeah, you're right. It is kind of the standard version of that. Trev hasn't played a lot. Yeah, Trev... Well, Trevenant is weak to dark, and it's it's a little inconsistent compared to other item locks. I mean, Eggrow Vileplume just bodies it in terms of better item lock decks. It is a good deck, but you're right, it is annoying. I'm just going to concede. I don't really want to play against this, to be honest. We're not going to... I don't know. I'm just not feeling that. Poison Gengar? Yeah. Yeah, the Baby Necrozma deck is good, but I hate playing against it. It's, it. It shuts off like half of the ideas in Expanded, because you can't play Shaman and Scubum Net because they have 
you know, you know Silent Lab and Wob and Garbage. It's just, the Ultimate Cosmo this is not cool. It is definitely... I don't think it's bannable. That's the only problem with it. It's not really a deck that I don't think could ever get banned. But it is a really annoying deck. What, what, what would you rather, though, Brain? ADP or Eternatus? You gotta think of that, bro. Play some Pika Rom. It's getting some hype, right? I don't really want to play Pika Rom, Zekrom, unfortunately, bro. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we can do the Player's Cup after. You're right, right. Well, this might be even sooner than I thought because we are playing against a Fire deck, which is pretty much an auto win for this deck. Best supporters are Marnie, Research Mount. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, boss, is, boss definitely has to be up there. You can't, you can't count out boss. You can't count out boss. Yeah, yeah, Eternus is fair. Like, if Eternus ever... Like, if ADP got banned, fighting decks would actually have a chance of, like, being popular again. That's what... That's why it's decent. Pikaram is going to suck after rotation. Yeah, probably. Well, it's going to suck because it's going to be gone. <laughs> Yo, I called the Marnie. That's why I put the Silvalli on top of the deck. Dan is best supporter. Yeah, you're right. Dan's better than Marnie in research. Big brain box, it rotates. Exactly. All right, let's... We can play the Player's Cup. We got a few notifications here to look at. I mean, Ghost, if you send me... Is it Aaron? Is you, Ghost? Oh, no, we... Oh, never mind. Right, he's out of the stream. Unfortunately, guys, I got to decline your friend request. I can't... I'm not accepting any requests right now because I need my list to open. Actually, wait. Hold on, hold on. Let me... I need to go check Reddit real quick. I have a... I have a game plan for a tournament here at 3... 3 p.m. PST tomorrow. Okay. So, all right. So we can probably do one quick, quick player's cup. Let me just see if I, if I, have, if I have a decidui deck. That's why I want to play. That's why we want to play. So the oh, we'll play the OPOP League Desi Goons deck here because I don't want to. Let's be honest. We're gonna get body by ADP. We could, I honestly could play Center Scorch too. Turns only good if it has good starting hand. I don't know. Eternus can make comebacks. I've seen him make insane comebacks. ADP needs a reprint. Nah, bro. ADP does not need it. I, nah, ADP needs to go. All right, let's try this. I mean... Uh, did we like the deck? Wait, did we like it? Okay, we did. Decidueye over Altaria. Yes, sir. I actually don't like Altaria that much because it gets bodied by uh, Volcanion. Personally, I actually think Decidueye is still better than Altaria. I don't know. It's like Altaria gets, it just gets bodied. It has more, it, it has less HP. It, it can attack for a single energy, which is better, but it doesn't have as much HP. So that's why I'm not really a fan of Altaria Obstag Obstagoon. About Sky Judgment Dragonite? What about it? I would play Intellion or Senescorch. Yeah. All right, look at that. Told you. First game we hit an ADP deck. What, what did I tell you? It's like everybody plays 80. I don't know, man. It's kind of, it seems sus to me, folks. Seems sus to me. Hopefully the Players' Cup 2 wakes Pokemon up and like, oh, everyone played ADP in the Players' Cup and it won the Players' Cup and everyone complained about it. Yeah, I think this deck needs a ban. It is the best counter, but uh, it's not the best counter when uh, you're playing against ADP. But it is weak to Psychic, though, Chris. Oh, that top deck, though. We could hold the hand. In theory, I don't hate that. I'm very tempted to just hold here. No, we're going to research. Whatever. Pokemon Center Lady literally counters Butterfree. But Butterfree doesn't, isn't that good. No energy. You hate to see it. We have Rosa in our hand. I also bench this and pass. No energy is not ideal, but whatever. I play Butterf... Actually, yeah, it's really bad, because we could probably could have gone to turn two to Situai. Attack off. If ADP was reprinted with Psych Weakness, it would not fairy. Okay, that would be a lot better. If ADP had a better weakness, it would be a lot more balanced. hundred percent be more balanced if it had a better weakness. Well, that's all she wrote. We got a dead hand, and we're playing against ADP. Cape of Toughness, bro. Are you serious? We still two-shot him, though. Dragapult VMAX with Taliban be popular? Yeah. 
If we can ban Reprimis Magius. Well, I get the idea, Beloved Bryce Man. It, it would make that Excadrill mill deck a lot more popular, but at the same time, it does prevent it does prevent ADP from being ridiculous. Or no, sorry, prevents prevents those mill decks from ever being too good. Which I think is a good thing. Bro. I hate ADP, bro. I hate to do this, but we gotta get a supporter. See, this is why I don't play the Players' Cup. Playing against ADP, we're dead drawing. I mean, what do you want me to say? I could take the... He just knocked me the ring guru. I think I just go research. Maybe we'll try... Well, maybe you can try Sand Scorch. Maybe I'll do a Players' Cup stream at some point. I don't know. Dead hands are dead hands, folks. I don't think we need the goon. I think we'll scrap that. I don't even... We could just see a Milotic come down and wreck our day. I think we need to get another Drachi down, though. Got two nets left. I don't even know why I'm playing this out. I might just scoop. We're just drawing... Like, we're drawing poorly. I'm playing in a spooky tournament. We have to play darker psychic cards. What would you play? I don't know. I'd maybe probably Trevnor to be honest, because that's like the best psychic attacker. That's a ghost type. Yeah, waste of time. These players' cup sucks. I'm sorry. It is, it is a waste of time for me. I'm not even gonna bother playing that. I'm sorry, guys. I just ADP bad draws tilts me too much. Mm, yeah, no thanks. I'm gonna pass on the players' cup. I play the Galarian Weezing. And what though? Alright, let's try it. Let's edit this Dreadnought deck. I don't really want to play the Player's Cup, guys. It's just, I don't feel like playing against ADP const constantly. Didn't even get to snipe you. Didn't even get to snipe me. Nah, but like, I don't know. I, bro, it's just, it's an ADP fest. It's not fun. It's not fun to play. It's just not for me. Alright, let's just try this. Is Whale Lord your favorite whale? Eh, that's the best whale out there. Oh shoot, do I have the wrong deck clicked? Isn't Dragapult weak to Eternatus? It is, unfortunately. Dragapult would actually be still good if it had a weakness card energy, energy cost. Do you have a Nintendo Switch? I do indeed. Just right here. Would you want to play a deck I made? Star Raptor Lugia? But I, I, it's, that's kind of just like my Swana Altaria Lugia thing. I don't, I don't know, man. Play Whimsicott? I might, I'm gonna play, I'm definitely gonna be playing a Whimsicott deck to, um,. I'm definitely going to play a Whimsicott deck in the OPOP OP League. I do have that in mind. Whim doesn't power, doesn't counter ADP. It doesn't counter it. It's cool and all. If you, if you get lucky, you definitely can beat ADP, but yeah. I have played it, Willy and I, Wiley. I have played it and I have beat it three times. Just stop watching one of your videos to watch the stream instead, lol. Yo, welcome, bro. All right. Uh, probably I should have Ring Guru first. I might just dead eight change. Yeah, I think I'm gonna dead eight change. Just get energy in the discard. Yeah, let's just dead eight change. I think I screwed up. I should have gotten um, should have gotten an Articuno, but I want to bench the type null. Is Phalanx V good? It's decent at countering Eternatus. Yes. If Gramble, I don't know if Gramble would be good though, because Gramble, I don't think it can beat Eternus V Max, because it only does 160 damage. But I guess like you could play Gramble with like Vitality Band, and then you do, yeah, maybe 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 Gramble could have beaten Eternatus. Maybe it can beat Eternatus. Flinks would be so much better with Special Charge. Yeah. Is anyone else excited for Memory Capsule Clefable Lock? I don't even know what that does. Oh, definitely I will do that, Bob, for sure. Okay, we're playing against a Mew 3 deck. Interesting. Italian feels like it has a decent match against ADP. It does, but it, it again, comes down to what you bench. If you bench two to Dene's or a Crobat to Dene, you lose that matchup. Like, you can play a deck that's really good, but because of the speed of the format, you have to play, you have to play those, bro, this guy's gonna body me. You have to play those cards, which is really annoying. So like, it's just not good. The format's just too fast right now for like a lot of decks to rest. That's the problem with ADP. It's like you have to play to Dene and Crobat and then you bench them and you get bodied. 
it okay the station doesn't Golurk hits the numbers apart. Yeah, exactly. Golurk, I actually have to make a. I have to make a deck on that. I have to make a video on that still. I just conceded that because there's no point of sticking that out. We're gonna lose that anyways. We got 55 likes, yo guys. If you guys want to, uh, if you haven't liked the stream yet, make sure to do so. Help out the likes because the likes are glitched right now on YouTube, for me anyways. Like, for example, here's what happened. So I went to like a video. I, on my LDF Patreon account where I post my post my Patreon videos too. I uh, I liked my uh, what was the video? Was it was uh, what was? I liked the Tina Chomp Curse video and it had forty nine likes at the time. So I liked it on my LDF Patreon account and it went up to fifty likes. And when I went back to my main channel, the video only had um, the video only had um. What am I trying to say? The video only had 49 likes. It should have went up to 50 because I liked it on my Patreon channel, but it stayed at 49. So the likes were glitched, which is probably why my views dropped off. If you saw, my Venusaur video had 4K views, and then my my vi yeah my Venusaur video pulled 4K views, and then the Graphlock video before was I'm struggling to pull like 2.5K views. My views dropped nearly 2,000 views, randomly too. The algorithm changed, and arguably, the likes not working, it means the video doesn't get pushed out as much, which is why the, which is why the views dropped. That is why, that's why I needed to say, you guys gotta like the video, because I was experimenting. And look at that, the Green Altaria video had 11, 000, 1100 views, and it had over 160 likes. Because the video got pushed in the algorithm because the likes were broken. See what I mean? YouTube needs to fix their stuff. This is super frustrating. So it's like, it, it just feels bad when you drop in views. Oh, where is a Salamence deck? Interesting. I thought it was going to be a Torkoal deck. The Clefable that puts on top. Oh, interesting. All right, I think we just, I think we just dead a change. Can you do streams on YouTube more? When I move into my new house, I'm probably going to start streaming on Twitch. Actually, eh, we should probably could have kept that in play. I think we want the Glimwood, though, but... Mm, kind of wish we could keep that. We only have two Glimwoods. All right, we got Articuno. Beautiful. Do you think that Pokemon will ever reprint Fairy Pokemon? Hopefully. 68 likes in the stream. Yeah, it's at 71 now for me. But yeah, it's like... I don't know why YouTube had to be broken. It. I find that YouTube breaks, like, around, like, the fall time anyways, but... Like, the summer is usually hot for, like youtube for views but yeah your videos weren't appearing for me for a few days i jumped your channel yeah i knew it i see i told you something was broken i told you man it's like god youtube is so it's such a poorly run website i swear it's it's amazing but it's poorly run because it just it's it's broken all the time they need to they really need to fix their stuff i'm not allowed to watch on twitch why is that landon but yeah, I do want to, like, because Twitch is another way to make, you know, extra income, help me, you know, do this full time. And Twitch is probably better for streaming than YouTube is. Because YouTube, again, it's broken. I've even heard rumors in the past where YouTube actually, you, you, your channel gets hurt if you stream. So, like, if you, if I were to stream, I would lose, my video, my next videos would just not go in the algorithm. It's like... You, YouTube, it's it's just a broken website. I hate it. I actually hate it. <laughs> Family won't let me? Why is that, though, dude? Greed and deck replaced with Clefable memory capsule? That could be busted. Yeah, YouTube's, it, YouTube is always just, like, it's messing up all the time. It really is. Like, I do appreciate YouTube for what it is, but it's, like, the, it's always so buggy and glitchy. It's always, it's always just buggy and glitchy, and it's like, it's a headache, it's always a headache to, to have YouTube, bro, it always is. Okay, this is pretty busted, we'll bench this and pass. That's the problem with YouTube, it's like, the algorithm is always changing, so like, one minute you could be always getting recommended, then the next minute, YouTube takes you out of the algorithm and they say, oh, your content isn't good enough for us to put in the search recommend. That's probably what happened. But the likes are also glitched right now where like, if you like a video, sometimes your like doesn't even happen. And it's like, awesome. Let's just screw creators over even more. It's like, bro, 
if the fact that this is people's full-time job and it can get screwed over really easily is so retarded i don't know i i don't want to have to turn this into a rainy stream bro but youtube needs to fix their crap hopefully this this like bug thing gets fixed soon because and like every video i'm going to start asking for likes which i don't want to i don't want to be i don't want to ask for likes but like if i notice the likes and the views are just plummeting because youtube is broken then i have to ask for likes again it sucks how it works Kramer and VMAX Porygon Z. Yeah, I'm going to play that. Why isn't everyone playing solo Altaria with Drachi Mewtwo? What is that? But no, it's because VMAX is Mateo. It's going good, Herbivore. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, definitely we can try that at some point local. Shine of Memories. Yeah, guess what? Yo, what is that? What 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 is it spawn? I just priced all my Eternus VMAX. How many did you play? Four? In Players Cup. Keck W. Watch you still win, though. Okay, hold on. I gotta stretch, guys. Ugh. Give me a minute. How long have you been streaming for? An hour 21? See, I can't stream in classic mode anymore on YouTube. And I can't see how long I've been streaming before you... Oh, no, no. It says right there. Yeah, I've been streaming for about an hour and 21 minutes. I love YouTube, but it's so bad. Demonization is everywhere. Yeah, the... Do Luckily, PC Joe is safe enough not to really be demonetized. I don't swear in my videos because if you swear, you can literally get demonetized. Don't worry if you need to, too. Yeah, I just don't want it to sound desperate, but if I have to start asking for likes now to push the videos in the algorithm, because I asked for likes in my Green Altaria video, the video literally gets 1,100 views in three hours, which is the best a video has ever done in the past four months. That is saying something. So I might have to start asking for likes again. I might have to make like a like goal. If we can reach 100 likes, this will happen, whatever. I don't want to do it, but if YouTube wants to keep screwing over people, then I don't have a choice. Oh, what the co what, bro? Can I get a Keck W in the chat? This man plays Coco V, bro. What? I thought this was like a welder box deck, but this guy's got Coco. I always will like your videos from now on. Yo, I appreciate it, Corey, a lot. 100K petition for Pokemon tattoo. I could get one, yeah, for sure. I don't even. I want to get a tattoo. I was gonna get a tattoo of my dog. But uh, I just haven't gotten a tattoo yet. I do want to get one though. I don't want to be like insanely tatted up because I just don't think like it fits me. But I do want to get a tattoo, at least a couple. Stream on YouTube or the kind of yeah, exactly. It's true. It's the only place you can swear. But I've sworn on stream a few times. But like that was, I think that was like the heat of a battle. It was like it was an intense match. What's your favorite Pokemon? Hydreigon, bro. It's got to be Hydreigon, the mascot. So, what do we want to do here? Do you want to boss that Torkoal? I'm actually scared of the Torkoal because it removes my energy. But we have, well, I guess it doesn't matter, right? We have, we have thing. Right, let's rip a, let's rip an air balloon here. Aw. We have boss. Okay, well, Marnie and Giant Hearth and shuffle the deck. You are the best Pokemon YouTuber ever. Yo, thank you, Corey. I was a Coco V in a Japan Phalanx deck. Yeah, but that deck played, uh, that deck played, uh, Thing. Now I forget what Thing is. Thing is Thing. You know what I mean, guys? Thing is Thing. No, no. It was, um, I remember now. It was, uh, it was, uh, what's his face? He was playing, uh, why can't, Coco Prism. That's what I was thinking of. What breed is your dog? My dog was a Bichon Poodle. But she passed away in May. She lived to be 14. Sad times. This year has actually just sucked ass, man, I swear. <laughs> it's like, life gets completely shut down, pretty much. And a lot of people have died this year. Which is very, very sad. This has been a very bad year for history. Please say like three times. Like, like, like. Yeah, Coco. Let these die. <laughs> Bro, what do you mean, local? Nah. Charizard VMAX from Champions? Nice. You can trade that off. If, you, if you're not going to use it, I would trade it off because it's probably worth a few packs. And it will drop in value because they announced that Champions Path is going to restock. So Champions Path is going to decrease you more. Now, I live in uh, I live in Canada, Tom. Do you think Reshiram and Zekrom is viable? I mean, it doesn't do enough damage, but it might be okay. 2020, yes, it is trash. Do you collect Pokemon Earl or I? Yeah, for the most part, I just build IRL. I play PDCG. I don't play, uh, I don't play IRL anymore. Algorithm set. Yeah, it's better than expanded. Do you have chat mods? I do. I outcast the mod. I have a few others. 
But for the most part, it's not that bad. Like the chat, I don't, I've had to mute a few people before, but it's not really been that bad. It's all good, Joseph, man. It's all good. It's sad, it's sad, but it's the way life is. 2020 needs to prove that people didn't have the 2020 vision. Indeed. Bad hand. Pokemon movie joke for the three types of field. Shiny Charizard VMAX. Yeah, that's true. No, I don't like the the Rainbow Rare VMAX doesn't look very good. I don't really like Rainbow Rare VMAX. Right, let's see if this guy replied. No, no, he hasn't replied yet for the tourney match. He said he might sleep in past three, so we have to wait to this tourney match. Maybe we do when we do the tourney match with him, that's when I'll end the stream. Like after the match is over. It's the best of best of three. So maybe that's when I'll end the stream. We each should, yo, maybe Big Pimpin, maybe. But when I do move, I'm gonna be moving into a bigger, bigger house, so I can. Str I'm trying. I want to stream at night. My streams might not be very high energy, and like I can't be loud at night. But I want to stream at night. That's when I really want to stream. Oh, we lost. When are you moving? At the end of the month. I gotta be out of the house on October 31st. This might be the last stream in this house. Probably will be. This house is too small though for me, but I will miss it. It was a very, it was in a convenient spot. But my new house is literally gonna be right by where my college is. So when I go back to school, I can just walk there. And there's a bar right there too I can go to all the time. So it's not that bad, but. I don't know. The bigger house is what I need though. I wanna, my new room, I wanna put LED lights in my room. And also maybe I wanna put like a neon sign in my room. I, just, I wanna pit my room out. I'm also, I'm sure you guys have already seen this, but. I got some sound foam here to put on my wall in my new house. So it can block out sound. Just make a, yo, I gotta be professional, bro. Gotta be professional. I stream late. Yeah, I wanna stream at night. Start streaming day one. No, no, no. I got to set up first. I'm going now. It was nice to watch you. Good luck. And yo, thank you, Tom. And thanks for the donation, bro. Peace out. Nighttime is way better than day. The nighttime vibes are usually the better ones, right? That's why I kind of want to stream at night. If you're not live on November 1st, I'm a Twitch. <laughs> but yeah, I'm hoping, I'm hoping the transition to Twitch is good. How does your family view your full-time content creator decision? They, my dad, my dad approves of it. My mom's 50-50. My mom, my mom likes it, but... My dad approves of it more than my mom. Like, they don't disapprove of it for anything, but, like, they do find it to be a little kind of, like, out there. But it is, they do, my parents both approve of it. My dad wants to help me, like, build, like, a better setup and stuff. Yeah, they're cheap on Amazon, too. They're, like, 20, like, 30 bucks. What are you playing? I'm playing Dreadnought Rose. I'm going to switch the deck up, actually, after this game. Oh, we're against uh, Lightning. Can we beat this? We have one weak guard energy. How do you get more coins? Grind the ladder. Attorneys, you get 400 coins for winning a tournament. If you don't mind me asking, do you live off of YouTube? Currently, yes. Like, I don't drive or anything right now, so I don't have too many bills to pay other than, like, rent and, like, going out to eat and movies and buying stuff. The nice thing about not having a car is I can blow my money on expensive stuff. <laughs> like, expensive clothing. Not real. I don't buy Gucci and stuff. Like, I think designer clothes like Gucci and Louis Vuitton, you, you shouldn't buy it unless you're, like, rich. If you if you buy it and, you, and your income is, like below the poverty line don't even bother buying designer clothing but i do buy streetwear clothing which is like kind of expensive but kind of not it's affordable like my next big purchase that i want to make i'm gonna get, i'm gonna be buying a bay hoodie but yeah I, I, designer you shouldn't buy gucci and louis vuitton if you can't afford it all the time like if your income is not that good well, don't buy design it's a waste of money but dad stream <laughs> one day we don't joke about dad streams no, I don't know. Oh, the big charge realized we can't one-shot him now with the heads on the coin flip. You're trying to live off playing drums? Good luck, man. Good luck, dude. All right, uh, let's go here. We can discard the whole hand, right? Yeah. We can get a couple basics. We can go... Do we have the weak guard in the deck? We do. So we can go double our Akuno. We get uh, another type null. Oh no, we have to go to Dene. What am I saying? We have to go to Dene. Oh, it looks like we recognized. Could give that heart hello. 
go here. Uh, do, do, what do I want to do? I guess we'll play the Guru. I don't really see a reason not to. We could get Marnied, right? When you have an empty hand? You think so, Savon? I don't know. I'm a live drum. I opened it for Lil TJ and Fabio. That's actually sick. Lil TJ, is, he's a good rapper. Crobat only draws six with an empty hand. Yeah, but we probably should use Crobat. Whatever, it is what it is. Yeah, I guess then we get tag bolted. I mean, what are the chances we even win this game? We're playing against a lightning deck, right? Right, we're playing against a lightning deck. We have one weak guard energy? I don't know. Seems kind of sus. Well, Rip Glim with Tangle. This guy's got swell. I think he only plays one, actually. I'm pretty sure this is the list that won last night. That's pretty sick, though, Jordan. But yeah, man, the best thing you can do... Best thing you do, man, is just grind it, you know? Just, just grind every day. Just keep committing to what you want to do, and eventually you'll get there. Like, the way I see it is you'll always have growth. That's something that I've learned is, like, you'll always have growth. If you just keep committing to the grind, people, more people will notice you, and the more, you know, successful you'll become. There's always just grind it out. That's the thing with YouTube. It's like, with YouTube, like, I, what, I have 11k subs. This time next year, who knows, I could have 20k subs, right? You know what I mean? It's like, you just keep, every day, if you just, you, new people will always come to you if you just keep, every day, just keep doing what you're doing. Congrats on 11k subs. I really like your Swana decks, and when I think about it, there are so many good combos. Forgotten cards you think could become good sleeper decks? Thank you, bro. Um, Forgotten cards? I mean, I'm trying to think. I think, um, I don't know. I, I gotta think about that. Forgotten cards. I don't know, man. There's a lot of forgotten cards. Would you recommend grinding the theme deck turnies for packs? I could, yeah. It wouldn't be terrible. Did he not put energy in play? He didn't. What the heck? Okay. Uh, but I'm gonna another type null. Parasect Marble Clash. It's not bad. How many rows do we have? Three. We need to get uh, the big old. Uh, we need to get that weak guard energy. We need a Dreadnought VMAX. Not there. We can Evo Incense for. We can do Crobat next. Here's what we'll do get Dreadnought VMAX. We'll Guru the Quick Ball on top. That is true. Yeah, that Dugong was a forgotten card. Oh, we get the Dreadnought, but bruh. Rip. So now we need to get Hedge Knocks out. So this this turn should be perfect to knock out this Pika. I don't have a way to switch out of the Paralysis, though, which is pretty bad. That's right. Dugong was a forgotten card. What's your insta? I'll send you the TJ Kotcher and follow you? I don't have... Well, I have an insta, Jordan, but it's for, like, my main, like, personal life. I don't really, like, use it for YouTube or whatever. Okay, those are vehicles. We need to get weak guard energy this turn. So we gotta go Crobat. We need to get weak guard energy. Did not get it there. So Marnie. Do you have a Twitter, Jordan? We can follow each other on Twitter. There we go. We got the weak guard. And we got the Savali. Alright, busted. busted your content is really engaging yo thank you joseph yeah i try to i try to you know be as entertaining as i can be you know i try to be entertaining they can't boss you yeah yeah i know all right so we need to get heads to knock them out uh, no 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 how much hp does he have 40 hp if we knocked him out, I actually think we had a good chance of winning. Honestly, I think we literally, we I think we had a good chance of winning if we knocked him out here. I think we lose now. Good stream as always. See Yo, thank you, Jalen. Peace out. Yo, thank you, Evan. Or Beetle. Organize the opponent's top deck, Licky Licky. I do have an Or Beetle deck built. Oh, he has hammers. That's right. I do have an Or Beetle um, Marowak deck I might do a video on. I'm excited for Or Beetle VMAX too, to be honest. That looks like a fun card. Can Dreadnought be Luke Metal? Probably not. 
maybe Dreadnought Rose, because I think the problem with Luke Metal is if they hit, like, Full Metal Wall is really bad. Like, that extra 30 damage makes all the difference. Thank you, Corey. I appreciate it, bro. Thanks for stopping by. What is he doing? Only 120. Okay, we still have 250 HP. I mean, he does body him a lightning ride, though. Yeah, and he realizes that. Okay, I don't think there's really anything I can do. How much is a Crobat V? It's like around 16 packs. Okay, we gotta stamp the four. We can save the stamp next turn. I think the only way we'd win this, we had a Dreadnought, and then we can go Rose into a Dreadnought V Max out of nowhere. That's still, I think the only way we can win this. Actually, no, we can't one-shot me with Raichu. Do we want to stamp him now, then? Stamp him the four real quick. Sure. I, I don't want him to get a Crushing Hammer. That's the only thing I'm scared of. If we can knock him out with Articuno here, I think he'd be in a pretty good spot. What's your Twitter? Uh, Little Dark Fury. No spaces. Oh, now we get heads. Okay, there. I see you, Dreadnought. I love videos, but I wait for them every day. Thank you. Yeah, I always upload at 9.30 a.m. in the morning, Canadian time. What's your Pokemon card? I don't know. That's, that's a tough one. I guess... I do like Vile Plume from Undaunted a lot. I've just, I've just had so much success with that card before, even in real life when I used to play. I played a lot of uh, Vile Plume when I played. And then, of course, I did pretty well in a tournament with Vile Plume, too. I think he realized he could paralyze me here. Can you make a deck with Misty Lorelei, Vaporeon, and Exegame of Cargo? I tried that. It was very inconsistent. Maybe for a future meme deck. Yeah, we don't have a way to... We don't have a way to switch. I think we... Do we have a way to switch? I don't think we do. Let's check. Yeah, we have no switching cards in here. This is the one downside of this. I didn't put Malolana. If we had Malolana, we'd be chilling. Yeah. <laughs> That's good to hear, Mika. You're the only piece show used to mix good decks with cards that are OP, just creative. Yo, thank you, Paolo. I appreciate it, dude. Um, yeah, I think we just lose here, right? Maybe, maybe not. No, he knocks me out. Yeah, the only I think the only way we'd be able to win is we have another Dreadnought VMAX. And he gets heads. Oh, he can item lock me. But wait, that actually doesn't even knock me out. No, it doesn't knock me out. I think he he threw. I think this guy just threw, because now we can boss this. Do we have another boss in the deck? We do. We also have Eldegoss. So what we do is we put the Eldegoss on top. What do you think about Garboda from Vivid Voltage? I think it's decent. No, we need heads. Thank you. So we can win this. If he doesn't heal or stamp me, we can... Or hammer heads on Arctic... Well, even if he does that, we can probably still find energy. He's out of hammers anyways. He threw the... Why would he... He should have just knocked me out with Tandem or Lightning Ride. Now we just win. Wow, that's a pretty satisfying win. All right, I see this guy messaged me back. I don't think he has. Hopefully my internet's fine. Now, there's a lot of people. There's people downstairs because we are... It's Thanksgiving right now for Canada in a few days, so... I'm going to be eating downstairs. Yeah, this guy threw the game. Why would he paralyze and bolt me, though? But anyways, GG's, dude. GG's, bro. I saw someone play a cool egg route Decidueye combo. Yeah, it could be good for a video. We'll see. Yo, nice Pokemon tech check. How you doing? Yeah, the guy's a messing me. I'm going to have to play tomorrow. We'll see. We'll see. All right, let's switch up the decks. I'm getting kind of bored of that Dreadnought deck. Tournament completed. So the guy with the ADP didn't win, which is good. Because ADP sucks. Got a friend request. Unfortunately, Kingland, I can't accept because I need my friends to open for tourney matches. Let's play something else now. Um, we could play this Rillaboom box deck I have. Let's play, let's play Rillabox. It's pretty much a Rillaboom deck playing a bunch of attackers like my Low Chicken Rhyperior to hit different matchups. Fair Pokemon card. That's a tough one, Ashwin. I honestly can't I can't say. Oh, Vile Plume Undaunted. I already said they have Vile Plume Undaunted. Good Noodle. Do you play in Giovanni's Exile? Five coin. I finished the versus rewards last night. I was grinding Mad Party for about an hour. That's why I'm done the last. That's why I'm done rewards. Ah, these hands, bro. Hey, that stings. Unbanned life Singer's trump card, bro. Kick W. I can actually, I can see, I can see a reason for Wally to get unbanned. But I don't know about last year, man. Last year trump card's a little. I know you probably need sarcastic though, Kappa. All right. 
It smells like something's burning. I think that's from downstairs. So hopefully my house isn't going to light up on fire. Yeah, actually, I don't even care if this house burns down. I'm not even living in here. Who cares? The other people can they can have my uh, burnt remains in my room. Do you really hate ADP? Yes, I do. ADP is bad for the game. That's why I don't really see much ADP in my videos when I'm playing like a rogue deck because like half the time I play games, I just lose. <laughs> Yo, it's all good, Jordan. Oh, yeah. Did you follow me on Twitter? Let me check. Why is boss so expensive? Bro, that top deck. What is this, bro? Why you gotta get, bro? That's all my real booms, and they go to the bottom of the deck. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bro, this game is such a troll, dude. I swear, bro. I swear. I mean, what do I, bro, like, what am I supposed to do? Oh my goodness, bro. Oh, I'm, bro, I'm, oh, it's, it's, can you clip that on YouTube? Let me see. Create highlight video. What does this do? Oh, I can't create a highlight video? Bro. Someone need, bro, that needs to be clipped, bro. That is actually hilarious. That needs to be clipped. That is actually hilarious. What are you doing tonight? I might go with my friend to see a movie. Just followed? All right, I'll... Let me check. I forgot to do that because I kind of got a little cheesed about our hand. We're, well, it's a mirror match. It's a mirror... It's a mirror Aurora box matchup. All right, I got you with that follow, Jordan. I see. Yeah, there's a vanilla list, too. Nice. Okay. Never as good as the Blissey clip. That clip, that is, yeah, that's my favorite PDC Joe moment of all time. That Blissey thing on Santa Conda. Why are you moving? Uh, just because the landlord we are living in is selling this house. I don't know if it's because of COVID or if it's because the, I think it is. I think it's because the, the house price went up. Dude, the living expenses in my area is so trash. I swear to God. You get a three bedroom house, bro, it costs you like, it's like, it's it's insane how expensive the, the price of living has become now. It sucks. Like, a, a three-bedroom small house should not be that much money, but because of the way life is right now, it is. I might just scoop this, right? He's going to go Torkoal next turn, and then I cry. Pro I should have done an Ornate Rod. Yeah, I'm just going to concede. Marnie shuffles the deck. I wish Marnie shuffled the deck. I can rewind the stream and record my phone screen. No, nah, it's all good, local. Yeah, I can, I can screen record with OBS. It's all good. Or I can download the video and then just clip it. The Rillabooms wouldn't go to the bottom. They did go to the bottom because Marty doesn't shuffle the deck. Who do you live with? I live with my mom and my aunt. And I have people downstairs too. My cousin lives downstairs, but they're not going to be living in our new house. Can you make standard Excadrill? Probably not Pokemon. I'm not really a fan of playing those type of decks. Actually, I don't even know if I want to start with Egg. I guess we should actually. You know, we're playing a fire deck. Why did I start with that? Oh my gosh. I didn't even realize, bro, the deck. Oh my goodness. Now, Marnie doesn't shuffle the deck. Marnie, you draw. You, you just pretty much draw four cards, put the cards at the bottom. Yeah, it is stressful. I hate moving. I mean, I kind of like moving into a bigger house. It's not like, I, like the best thing is I'm not moving into like the air, like a bad area. It's just, I just don't like moving. Let me go my low tick here. I think I just dead a change. I shouldn't have started with this. I should have started with like Eldegoss or something. Never punished. I just got my low tick. I want to make a video on this Rillaboom box deck. It looks really sick. Uh, so far though, I'm not drawing very well. Shout out from Brazil. Yo, Paolo, how you doing? ADP bad? Yes, it is bad. My cousin won't let me... Won't let any card be used in our little family tournaments. Why is that? Hmm. He's last from every deck. It should go in this deck. It does. No Mari does over the deck. Yeah. I really don't like Zacian. I think Zacian is all overpowered too. I think it I think it that ability is ridiculous. <laughs> and then the new uh metal energy coming out, it's only gonna be a little it's gonna be even more powerful. Like I know Giratina exists, so like Giratina does help with that matchup, I guess, but like that metal energy is OP. What's your real name? My real name is Matt. M-A-T-T. ADP, not bad. ADP aggravating, not good. It is. Zacian is nerfed by Grimmsnarl. Nah, but Grimmsnarl's not that good, though, bro.
It can't be. Zacian without ADP is not OP with us. I mean, ADP would still probably have a broken combo. Zacian got banned, right? I think it's just man ADP is the way to fix it. Like, Zacian's good, but, like, uh, there's enough fire support right now to make, like, Zacian less good. The new Charizard VMAX, in real life, it's worth a lot of money. Um, well, yeah, in real life, it's kind of, the Rainbow Rare is expensive. But if it's from Champion's Path, in PC Joe, it's worth, like, 10 plus, I think, or around there. IRL, it's worth, like, 100 bucks, I think, or even more. This guy puts three Jirachis in play. Are we playing? I oh, hope we're not playing his Baby Blounds. I don't think we are. Are we? The Froakie deck box and sleeves. I don't know if you can get those tradable frog. I know. I think there is a tradable version of them, but I, the one you're thinking of that was in the item shop, I don't think. I don't even know if you could buy that with gems at the time. Yeah, it's not allowed to be a decent reprint. But the problem is, and then if they would just predict that and just play like 20 different um, counters, they would just play like four swells. Yeah. You see, Zacian as a tech card? Yeah. I had a nice chat about ADP, and we all agree ADP is too good. It is. No cap. I haven't played that yet, Steve. I have not played that yet. He's got nothing? We don't have uh, Thwacky anymore, so we're just going to go Marnie. Oh, we should have switched, actually, into the Grookey. Hey, we got the Rillaboomer. Let's go. Okay, maybe not. Maybe we're actually in a good spot. So this is how this deck works. You just you need to get a Rillaboom down to ASAP. I could, I'd, I would be down for beach. Yeah, festival is trash. <laughs> it is a trash tier card, Tech W. Okay, right, let's take a knockout with uh, this thing. Hopefully, Agrao lives a turn. He is down three switch, so there's a chance the Draji can't move. Oh, that's a huge top deck. Oh my gosh, that is huge. That's a huge prize. Swells like laser. Laser's annoying. Laser's fine, but it's like it's annoying when it gets heads and you don't wake up. ADP is a very powerful card, so I'm likely will get banned. I think it should get banned. I think it ruins the format. It just makes it less fun. Like Pokemon ban cards that make the game less fun. Like you gotta think Trev, you know, Wally, you know, the hand lock cards they keep banning. They're all cards that make the game less fun. ADP is the same thing. It might not like lock you or anything, but it's just like it creates a point where like half of a set, like when Pokemon makes a set, it's like more than half of the set is never going to ever see play because ADP exists. Like, what's the point of playing this card when it just can't beat ADP? That's a great example right there. That's an argument I don't see many people talk about is that ADP makes half of... Like, yeah, ADP completely makes most of a new set that Pokemon releases unusable. It's like, you can collect the set, but, like, you want to play a lot of the cards in the set, they are completely unusable because they'll never be able to beat ADP. That's why... That's another great argument is all the new Pokemon tries to make all these new sets out of these really cool new cards, but they'll never work because ADP exists. So like this, you might as well just make like a set, like have four cards in it that are ever good. That's another, that's a great argument with ADP. It's like, again, that's an argument I don't see many people talk about is it, it prevents half of a new set from ever being ever worth going for. How much ADP worth? I think it's around 10 packs. It does prevent one, but it's also, yeah, it's a poorly designed card. What's your favorite breakout deck? I don't know what that means, Paolo. ADP is going to rotate. It will rotate, but it'll still be in standard. And that's, yeah, that's nine months of ADP. Like, just imagine the amount of decks that could pop up if ADP got banned. Like, okay, another example. So let's just say there's a... To the, okay, let's just... Oh, it's a Blounds deck, bro. I don't want to play against this. So let's just say there's a tournament with people in it. That made no sense. But let's just say there's a tournament with, like... You know, 300 players, right? You look at a pie chart. The pie chart, ADP takes up a big chunk of it, okay? But let's say there's a tournament where there is no ADP. That pie chart has a bunch of other pies on it because there's more decks that actually get a chance to, you know, have competitive value because there is no ADP to deal with. So then that pie chart becomes bigger, which means there's more diversity and creativity in the community, which means there's more cooler archetypes, which means cooler cards that don't really work that much get a time to shine because they don't have to worry about ADP. That's an, that's an example. It's like, it just, it allows more decks to be playable and it allows more cards and new sets to be playable and not just binder trash. There you go. That's a great example. 
because ADP prevents that from happening. Let's see if he knocks me out here. Three energy in your hand, one time, no cap. I mean, bruh. If ADP was weak to Psychic, we can see Dragpult or Krimi. It would be nice if ADP had a better weakness, but uh, yeah. Like, I, I don't see why Pokemon stopped printing Fairy types when they made one of the most overpowered cards of all time. That was a really, that was a bad game design decision. Oh, I didn't mean to play the Quick Ball. No. Uh, can we go Crobat? No. Oh my gosh. I did not mean to play the Quick Ball. Oh my goodness. We have to get rid of the NDDV. I did not mean to play the Quick Ball. I wasn't thinking. Okay, we have Ordinary Rod. We're fine. I did not mean to play that Quick Ball, though. The problem is ADP is weak to Fairy, and they get... Yeah, exactly. They get rid of Fairy. It, it, makes, it makes no sense. Like, what's the point of getting rid of Fairy when, when ADP exists? It doesn't... Yeah, it's, it's just weird. It is very weird. Let's see if we can reply with a KO here. Can we find a boss, maybe, off our prize, if there is one prized? Get a switch. The problem is... Yeah, I already read that. I love ADP and Expanded. ADP is more balanced and Expanded because there's better cards. Like, Mad Party and, like, Necrozma can beat ADP. Even though they get the extra prize, those decks are just so fast, they can destroy it. And Pokemon Ranger is. So I think ADP is balanced and Expanded. I think it's Standard. It ruins the format and it kills the game. Exactly. Yeah, Fairies should never have been stopped printed. They should just keep printing Fairy types to keep ADP. They should make good Fairy types. Not Fairy types that suck. They should make good ones. Like, they should make more Guardians, more uh, Grambles. Just ones that are good. I was gonna upload an ADP rant video too a while back, but I never I never did. Maybe I should have because ADP is it's ADP. Well, we have 300 HP technically. That's actually good. 300. We have to, they have to do 300 damage with Fireball Circus. Have you Pokemon Sword Shield Nintendo? I have, and I have beaten it three times. Make ADP weak to every type. <laughs> yeah, make it. That'd actually be OP. I think the best weakness ADP could have is Dark because it turned is or Fire. Fire or Dark would be great because then at that point it's like ADP gets bodied by Fire. Hmm. I think we lose. We can't. Yeah. This is a bad matchup this deck anyways. It sucks. We had such a good setup here, but we had to play against an awkward matchup. You hate to see it. Guess we could put him to sleep. I guess that has to be our play. I don't think I play a reset stamp though. Your favorite Pokemon game? Uh, Pokemon Emerald. I don't think we have Stamp in here, so it doesn't matter. Go boom, boom. Get two grass. Yeah, I don't think we're going to win this. Um, we'll see, though. If he stays asleep, maybe we have a shot of winning. Okay, I like my odds a little bit more now. He just has to not be able to hit 300 damage. Mew Mew beats ADP without Latios. I mean, Mew Mew can beat ADP. Yeah, it is possible. Yeah, they would be more viable. But I, I think the best weakness you give it is like... I mean, Metal would be a good weakness too, because then Zacian could wreck it. Dragon resisting fire. Yeah, it would make sense. Yo, Nitrogen, how you doing, bro? Your favorite Pokemon is Hydreigon, bro. What's this deck? It is... Oh, he touched the active. It's a, a Rillaboom Counterbox deck. I haven't heard from this guy yet. Dialga, Palkia, no plates are weak to fighting. Huh. Okay, I think we can actually win this now. Go here. We go Marnie again. Okay. So we just gotta live the turn to win this game. So we have to survive if we're gonna win. If we if we get knocked out, we lose. If we don't get knocked out, we win the game by knocking out Dedene. 
So it'll come down to this. If we can survive the turn, we win the game. He has to do 300 damage with Fireball Circus. He's down eight energy, three Fiery Flints, three Welders. There's a chance he doesn't knock me out here. There is a chance he doesn't kill me. I can't wait until Viv Voltage release. That's the nasty Garbiter card. Yeah. I don't like VMAX. Just feels like a very bad power. I think the power creep is a little ridiculous, but as long as they just make VMAXs, like, you know, have good weaknesses and they make cards that can compete with VMAXs in terms of power, I think VMAXs are fine. Yo, appreciate it, Nitrogen. Why oh, you play basic fire? Just so we have a different. So we don't have to always rely on Aurora Energy to find us basic energy to attack. So can he do 300 damage here? Only one energy. All right, yeah, I think this is game. Hopefully. If we lose, I'm going to cry because this is awesome. We, all, we had a shot of winning, bro. A shot of winning. Still, though, you see, this deck sets up. You just counter everything and you're chilling. I play a Fighting and a uh, Fire Energy because I think those are the best weaknesses you can hit right now. You can go Nine Tails fired against Zacian and Luke Metal. Then you can go Fighting with Rhyperior against um, Eternatus. So you don't have to always rely on finding a Roar Energy to attack with your Pokemon. And then you also have Ordinary Rod to get those energies back. I think we should play two Rods in this deck, though. So I only play one of each attacker. I don't play two of each. Yeah, same. I remember 180 HP was the norm. Upload this. Mm -hmm. I am going to make a video on this deck probably sometime next week. Maybe on the weekend. What is this 400 HP trash? <laughs> VMAX should have four times weakness. That would be more balanced. But at that point, it, they don't want to make them so bad they're unplayable. All right, please don't do 300 damage. He didn't play a crystal. Let's go. Let's go. We won. Let's go. I didn't think we'd win this, though. Honestly, this is a nice win. This is an epic victory royale. Just give me that big boy. Nice. These Cape of Toughness, I think, were what made this matchup pretty balanced. A cell go for the memes? Nah, bro. You're chilling. I thought Mega Yexes were insane. Yeah. All right. Let's swap over to Legacy. I know some of you guys might want to see a Legacy video. Let's swap over to Legacy. I'm getting kind of tired of Standard, to be honest. So let's play some Legacy. Uh, I'm going to play Mega Magna Zone. If anyone wants to stream snipe me, as long as you don't play as... And, whoa, we already found a game. Never mind. You can't stream snipe me, Kappa. Rapier Fullard has an awesome... Yeah, I like Rapier. I like uh, my low-tick Rapier Fullards a lot. Strategy for new players. Uh, collect theme, collect Relentless Flame, Grind Relentless Flame, and then try to go from there and build a budget deck and build that deck to a better deck. Have you pulled any good HSS cards lately? I was opening HSS base packs. I pulled a Reverse Hollow Pokemon Collector. I was basically just looking for like Reverse Hollows of like, you know, Switch, DC, stuff like that. I didn't really get anything insane, but I'm not going to be buying any more packs from the shop because I need to save my coins for, uh, I need to save my coins for Vivid Voltage. I think it's Plasma. You think OPOP -OP will do expanded? Oh, 100%. They're, I, I asked for Legacy 2. I don't know they're going to... They haven't announced the other formats yet, but I'm hoping Legacy is one of them. Because I already know what I'm playing for Legacy format. I already wrote... I already got my ideas for what decks I want to play in the Legacy format. I think there actually is an expanded one. I mean, I don't know. I can't remember. There's a theme deck one, which is going to be interesting. I know Relentless Flame is going to be on everyone's, on everyone's radar. An Ultra Ball. She, yeah, I should have saved that for Yamega, actually. Yeah, I should have saved that for Yamega. That was a misplay. And we can comp search next turns on the other world. I definitely should have saved that for Yamega, though. You save coin. Yeah, I, I want to save my coins to the new set. Because I want to do a. I'm going to open up 100 packs for the main channel, and then I'm going to do a 50 pack opening for my Patreon from the shop. Yeah, same. Legacy is my favorite format. Expanded would be my favorite format if there wasn't so many toxic decks. I tried building a deck with the dragon type Mega Rayquaza. With what though, Bob? And Typhlosion is good in Legacy, especially when you're playing as Virgin. Please end me. No. Any new tournaments coming up? Well, the OPOP -OP tournament's not like a tournament you can enter. It's only for content creators, but nah, there's no other content creator tourneys. Can you explain Legacy format for noob? It's a format with uh, set, say, HSS base set to Legendary Treasures. So, anything from XY and Sun and Moon and Sword and Shield are not in the format. Quick Balls and Amazing Jirachis. Yeah, like Quick Ball investment is needed. What are good decks for a beginner in Legacy? Uh, Weavile Execute, Lando Garb. Those are all cheap decks. What deck do you use for grinding? Expanded Mad Party. I posted on my Patreon some games with the Expanded Mad Party deck. I had some hilarious matches against Seltzer Cosma and another Mad Party deck. 
I haven't tried, but Expanded is too tough. Yeah, I mean, we also got Haunch Crush, another deck. Like, there's just too many, like, OP decks in Expanded. Cake is for nice beginners. I don't know about Cake. Oh, we don't have any Junipers. Not good. I don't want Mime to get it knocked out because we need it for this Curum. Ooh, busted hand. Let's go. This is busted. Holy crap. All right, watch this. Get execute. We can junk card for switch, which is what I want. This hand is OP. Dang, bro. We literally, honestly, I think we literally got the perfect hand we could have gotten. Because we also got the out for egg. That, yeah, that, that, that was literally the six best cards we could have got. That's insane. That is actually insane. I don't know if we are be able to attack this turn, though. Let's see. No. That's fine. So hopefully he doesn't play laser too. We can put this over mirror on. That was nuts. That hand was so good. What is the difference between legacy and expanded? A legacy has HTSS. Well, expanded doesn't have HTSS. You need two more for version. How much are Selby Primes? Selby Primes are a lot. They're like around 70 packs. No, he plays laser. Yeah, Triumphant is definitely and he gets heads, of course he does. And he has a juniper. Oh my god. If he gets a tool scrapper here, I might just concede because I don't want to deal with this. I was able to find a trade the other day where they offered the top and bottom half for 26 packs. Not nah, if it was 26 darks of blaze, it's okay. But like, I mean, because the Deoxys Legend is the best legend card, but I don't think it was. I don't think it's worth that much. Legends are not that expensive. They're hard to get, but they're not expensive. Best way to put it. Make a Genesect Celebi. Nah, I don't. I don't like playing Genesect. I think that deck is annoying as all hell. Okay, can we wake up? Bro. Ah. Oh, we got our own laser. All right. Uh, we're going to have to try to get a junk on him here. We can knock him out of Megazone Prime. No junk armor. Okay, well, level ball for another Yemma. We can max potion if we wake up. It's not that bad. Let's just pass. I'm not going to judge him. He has a three-card hand. He might have a dead hand. Okay. But, I, but like, RDL, like, it's expensive, and it's the best legend, but it's not even that much. I think I overpaid for my RLDLs, so. though. But I don't know. I think I, two, I did two bottoms two times. Is that, that's kind of catch, isn't it? Nope. Yeah, I did two bottoms two tops. When I did my trade. I think I traded for three pieces, not two. And I traded, like, around 30 packs. Or 30 plus packs. So I had a computer search in the trade. Aw, oh, if you say poison, we can knock him out on a boom. Do you play cake? I could play cake. I think I have a list build. Well, yeah, we can play cake after. I'm down. Would you consider playing other games on stream? Probably not. I don't really... I don't really have a way to record other matches. But no, I'm not really... Like, I, really, the only games I play are, like, my PlayStation and then, like, PDCGO. Like, I don't have any other PC games. Like, the only other PC game I'd get is Minecraft, so I can play with my friends. Legacy cake or standard cake? Legacy cake. Boy, legacy cake. Not standard cake. Do you have four maze rares in your deck? I don't know, actually. Oh, you can? Play Yu-Gi-Oh? I, low-key, I kind of want to re I kind of want to rewatch Yu-Gi-Oh GX. That's my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh show. I kind of want to rewatch that. The Raikou looks good to me. Yeah, it does. I, I, let's play Cake. I don't want to play against for, I don't want to play against Plasma today. Um, let's just do something else. It might be. Are you going to get PS5? Probably. Not right away, though. I don't want to get one right away. I, I will get it. So let's. Oh shoot! Almost deleted the deck. All right. Let's see. So this is the list I got for cake. Uh, is there anything I need to bling out? Not really. I don't think there's any other. Mm, don't have a. I don't have a Cobalion full art. Okay, whatever. That's fine. So this is my OG cake list I got here. We're gonna play it. And we're gonna have some fun. I think after this game, though, guys, I'm gonna actually hold on. Before we, if I let me just check my messages on Reddit real quick. No, guys, it messed me back. All right, not doing a tournament match then right now. So we'll, we'll do a, we'll do a cake game and then maybe I'll end the stream off. How long have you been streaming for? Two hours? Yeah, I'll, I'll end the stream after this game. I gotta go. I gotta go eat downstairs like really soon, anyways. So uh, I'm gonna end the stream after this game, assuming it's a good game, not like a quick game. The Mentis. If you're in the stream, bro. Yeah, we go first. 
Is Pichu OP in Legacy? Yeah, Pichu is really good in Legacy. It's good in a lot of- it's, it's only good in certain decks, not all decks, though. I can't find you, re. I might play Legacy tonight. Because I'm done the ladder, so I don't really- I kind of just finished the reverses reward, so I might do it. Ooh, mirror match, question mark? Our hand's a little sus. If we can draw, like, a dual ball and get double heads, that's pretty good. We could get N2. What exactly is Cake? Cake is Cobalion Curum Electrode. That's what it stands for, I think. It's a mirror match, yep. Okay. So, we can go Oak. Try to get some Pokemon to go boom. Bruh. That's not what you want to see. You don't want to see a handful of energy when you're playing Cake. Maybe I'll do a video on Cake for the channel. I, I did a video on this before, but I might do it again. Well, I don't play a collector in my deck. But, like, it's Dual Balls is a better card, right? Older cards look cooler even though they're less blinged out. Yeah, Reverse Hollow HSS cards are the best Reverse Hollows on the game. 100%. He gets an Oak here. That feels bad. Should I save for Viv Voltage or Escalator theme deck? No, save for Viv Voltage, Mika. That Kyrim is not good. I don't think there's only one Kyrim in this set. Other than VX in this format. For 30 packs as well. I mean, I, that might have been overpaying. If, if it was reverse hollow, it's a good deal. But 30 packs, I think, is way too much for Smeagol. All right, what are we looking at here? Okay, we got one basic. We're chilling. We actually have a decent hand. Assuming this guy has a supporter in his hand. Ooh. Oh, what do I want to do? I low-key want to go Pokemon Collector because I can go Boom twice here, but I also want to get Oak. Ah, oh, man, this is a tough... I think I just go Oak, right? Yeah, I'm just going to go Oak. I want... We, if I had a Supporter, I would 100% go Boom and go Collector. Okay, yeah, this is a better hand. All right, watch this. Here's how this deck works. So we Energy Might. Oh, let's go. That was a pretty good hit. All right, so yeah, we Energy Might. We get a bunch of Energy in play. That's how it works. So we go two metals. So we're going to go metal here, metal there. And then we'll go rainbow here, water there. Okay, so here's how we'll do this. So we go metal, metal. Oh, I forget the order already. Was it rainbow water? What was it? Rainbow water? Shoot. All right, we'll just put that there anyways. It was rainbow. Dang it. All right, we have a water in our hand, actually. It's fine. Let's we'll go water here. And he doesn't take a prize for doing this either, which is really cool. We got lucky, though. We got a lot of energy. Sometimes this can uh, completely uh, suck and you get nothing. So we're just going to pass. We're not going to do it again, obviously. Choose Pokemon to attach to. It did? Oh my gosh, bro. I didn't even know there was an alert banner. All right, that's a big Keck W moment, guys. That's a big... It doesn't matter, obviously. But, like, yeah, that's a Keck W moment. Read the text on the banner. Yeah, I'm an idiot. Lol. That's guys, let's get Keck W's in the chat for that. Oh my goodness. The cake mirror match though is pretty lit. Honestly, I wanted to do a for Alligator Prime Legacy video for my first legacy video on the channel after the break, but I kinda wanna play cake now for legacy content. Try Magikarp Waylord with Frostmoth, Misty Lorelei. Maybe. Maybe I'll do a dual Waylord deck. Let's see what he got rid of here. Oh, he's playing, I think he's playing like the classic build. Like he's playing like the OG build from the, no, I'm playing an update legacy build. I think he's playing more of a classic build from the OG era of the heart gold soul silver sets. It's the mirror match. Honestly, I don't, okay. Now I was going to say he has triple E. I, I was going to go with like, we could get our own Glacier. It's not going to matter. We have to attach, I think. All right, dual ball. What do I want here? I think we go Kirim. Hmm, I don't actually we probably shouldn't have attached, right? Yeah. I mean I could just energy might again and knock out the smirgle that I'd repair. Eh, maybe not actually. I'm just gonna pass. Unless he ends me, we'll try to catch her next turn. Unknown got banned. Yeah, and the unknown damage got banned. Mew Prime. Huge Arm Banner and Pokeball in the center. 
Oh. I'll remember that next time I do energy mine. Oh, he's got the catcher first. No, and he gets it. No. Some free Pokemon cards. I'm a noob. Oh, and he's got the end, bro. Rip. Well, we can do Super Rod, and then we can go Energy Might. This isn't bad. Yes, sir. I will look next time. <laughs> we can't knock out Cobalion in one hit either. I mean, we can go Retaliate. One thing we do have going for us, we can go Keldeo, so we can go out of his Iron Breaker lock that he does. Because we have Iron Breakers, we can't attack, so we can go Keldeo and then do Rush in. Maybe we just hit him here. We can build up some other stuff here in the background. Sure. I don't know. Retaliate. 50 damage. We can go land crush next turn, which will knock him out. Oh, we have special metal energy on. I didn't even see that. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay. Switch top deck. No. Okay. Not good. I think we're gonna- He has a way better setup than we do. Those Cobalions- We should've honestly went Cobalion to Trakian. Rebirth ho is playable? Yeah, it is. I have a ho deck I want to do too with uh, Shaman. I think we just gotta go here. We're not even knocking him out. Yeah, okay, we're definitely gonna lose this in my opinion. <laughs> it's not looking good. We can do this. Now, hold on, guys. All right, I had to mute the mic real quick. Okay, um, let's go you, you, you. <clears throat> All right. Uh, ooh, N or Chorus? I think we go N. I'll just hit him with a Blizzard Burn. Oh, it does knock him out. My math is off. Okay. I mean, this deck can't really beat a mirror match, but this is still cool. It still shows off both archetypes because it's the same deck, right? Black Kieran Crystal Wall. It's okay, but Tool Scrapper's in every deck, though. It's the only problem. That's the only issue. Yeah, but I gotta go after this game though, guys. I gotta go downstairs and eat. Ugh. We had a good stream though. Yeah, this is probably gonna be the last stream in this house too, which is kinda cool. So we can, I can look back on this video, but this is my last stream in my room. Maybe, actually, I'll show you guys my room here after this game. I'll, I'll get my webcam and I'll just show you guys my room. Uh, we don't get a prize yet, yeah. That reversal heads, I think, was huge, too. All right, what are we doing? We're down a lot of energy, so the odds of us hitting energy off the thing is a little low. Not what we need. So we got a junk arm. Like, I think we just lose this, guys. Like, I think it's literally impossible to win, but we'll see. We will see what we can do. I don't think you would want to run the wall. Nah. Oh, double. Okay, busted. Oh, we don't have the Cobalion. Rip. Yeah, we're good. If he didn't have all the Eevee lights in play, I think I would have went Glaciate. Could Energy Might now. Uh, and I'll end first, I think. Oh, no, I should have done Energy Might and then end. Oh, my God. I'm not thinking clearly, guys. I should have went Energy Might and then end because we would have a game a smaller hand. Kek W. Keck, W indeed. We're definitely not going to win this. So I think it's like impossible. Yeah, one energy. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely game over, guys. We'll see what we can do, though. Um. Retaliate? In the open, how many cards are you allowed to have in common different decks? 
Yeah, I don't know. I wanna, I wanna know that. I have an idea for a cool, uh, a cool deck selection for one of my um, next matches, but I don't know if it'll be allowed or not. That's the other thing. Yeah, I don't know how good it. I don't know. Do we have any energy left? We have two. Yeah, it's too late to win. If we didn't attach a Smeargle, I think we actually might have been okay. Omnipop League games would start with who, Landon? I think you just need to use common sense and not be a deep. Nah, it's all good. All right, yeah, we probably lost this. He's, yeah, he's, no, he's playing more of an updated build, but he's using the OG attackers. He always wants to use Cobalion and then Kirim. Well, that's all she wrote. I was getting the wall played. I mean, there's no point of playing this out, in my opinion. All right. Well, yeah, I think I'll end off the stream here, guys. I'm going to show you guys my um, I show you guys my room real quick. It's the last stream in my room. Might as well show it. Um, you said you had a 3 o'clock game. I did, but the guy, I never heard back from the guy. I'll have to rearrange it for tomorrow. Let's see if he messaged me. I can't even battle him right now. Anyways, I got to go. Yeah, he didn't message me. I gotta go anyways downstairs to eat some dinner because it is Thanksgiving in Canada. All right, so before I end the stream, guys, I'm gonna show you guys my room real quick. All right, check this out. Check this webcam. This is the last stream in my room. Might as well show you guys my room because I'm not gonna be living in this house anymore. So, it's my room. So, this is the desk where all the magic happens. As you can see, it is very messy. Um, very messy. I have coffee, chips, Skittles, a drink from yesterday, and G Fuel. That's a lot of caffeine. And I got... Got my Switch, Cologne. I got a bunch of G Fuel packets right here. The lighting's not very good. I got some G Fuel. I guess we can move this, right? And then, yeah. I got a bunch of Funkos. As you can see, it's just hard to navigate. But yeah, I got a Funko collection. There's my light. That's the light I use. Very ghetto setup. Yes, I record on this, and I got my mic set up here. Got some garbage. It's a small room. Like, that's one thing with this room. It is a small, small room. Um, this is the last time I'm living in this house, bro. It's the last time living in this house. Um, so I thought I, I thought I'd show you guys. I was gonna do a room setup tour for my Patreon, but I I scrapped it. I might I'm, I'll, I'll probably post a room tour just to watch it back whenever I feel nostalgic about this house. But yes, this is my house. This is my bedroom. My house. This is my bedroom. You can't you can't see it that well. It's not very good. This webcam kind of sucks for this. But you know what? I showed you guys enough. I think we're Gucci. But anyways, yeah, I'm gonna wrap the stream. I gotta set this webcam back up. All right, but yeah, guys, I'm going to wrap up the stream here. Thank you for... Whoa, it almost fell. Okay, hold on. All right, how is this looking? Is this angled properly? No, it's tilted. Okay, that looks a bit better. How does that look? Go back here? Okay, it's fixed. I'm probably going to lower it a bit more. All right, but thank you, thanks for watching the stream, guys. Uh, yeah, thanks for stopping by. My day's been made. You look so tall. I'm not that tall, Cap. I'm actually very small. I'm like 5'4". Can he, yeah, thank you, Doctor. Yeah, anyways, thanks for watching, guys. And, uh, yeah, hopefully, Mentis. GG's, bro. Maybe I'll play some Legacy soon. I want to, maybe I'll make a video on that kick deck, bro. So, keep an eye out for that. Anyways, thanks for watching, and, uh, 